<laughs> hey, <man. laughs> Welcome to the No Bubble Podcast, man. Oh my goodness, that's the way to start. Now nah, this nigga ill crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Facts. Definitely crazy, man. Welcome to the No Buffer Podcast. I'm your host, uh last name good and to my right we have the lovely. Cheyenne XO and to my right we have the Oh Lingo still. I'm sorry, I missed my cue. No, it's all good, bro. You, it's, it's, hey, look, okay. I just want to go on record before we even get crunked up, bro. Like, this gumbo straight, bro. Facts. Oh, man, that's love, bro. Facts. I appreciate that, man. <laughs> no, I just want on some mad shit, bro. Without further ado. Yeah, on some mad shit, bro. I just want to say that, you know, live to everybody public. Like, I appreciate that, man. So like, we, you did your thing. We got Thank two you. got my nose running, but it's all good. It's a little, it got a little spice to it. A little yeah. kick mm-hmm. to it. It's a little got kick. got my nose running. You know, the, that's why we all got, well, good got a bowl. I got a bowl, man. Me and, me and Steve up here with the cups. Yeah, we got yeah, yeah, we got those. Mm-hmm. This one you you're either cups, not trying right? to do dishes or True. you're not trying to be that greedy or both. So hold on, we're gonna act like Cheyenne ain't up here with the sauce though. She got the glasses on. You feel mm-hmm. what I'm she saying? don't switch up the barrette, like it's green now, fam. Yeah, you know. She got the got toes, the toes out? out? Yeah, I got the toes See, out. See, all it takes for her to get fifty eight plus. Bitches get loose. <laughs> <laughs> Bitches get loose. <laughs> don't know Man. how to act. No, I feel like it was a it was a nice day to wear my toes, and I just polished them, so I feel like okay, cool. What color the polish is? Yellow, Waffle House yellow, to be is it? Oh, and you got the nail. Okay, okay. Waffle House yellow. yellow. That's some that's some trash. soft talk right there, ain't it? Now, that's that canary motherfucker. Yeah, mm-hmm. that canary yellow. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's what's up right there. You been on your poetry shit lately too, bro? You know, I've your been, little poet vibes. I've been working a little more. Yeah, you doing, love you doing something. Shit. Yeah, I'm doing I think she, something. I think she's working on something. I'm working on something. Okay. It's coming. I you see know. the transition. Can I get a can I get a little haiku real quick? Mm. Mm. No, you gotta wait. <clears throat> Give me like twenty minutes. I say it gotta get it gotta, oh, just <laughs> gotta marinate. <laughs> <a little bit. laughs> you gotta yeah. marinate. You gotta marinate for a little second. Right. But how y'all doing? How was y'all weekend? Week weekend. Uh, Steve, you wanna go first, bro? I got a lot I got a lot to talk about. You I, ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't do shit, bro. Go ahead, bro. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's get to the good shit. <laughs> I ain't do shit either. Yeah, just go to the juicy shit. I ain't did nothing either. <laughs> All right, so I ain't um, bitch ass thing, bro. Go ahead, bro. <laughs> so first off, like I um I started last week off Wednesday to like Friday morning, just like feeling horrible. Oh, you had a cold? No, it wasn't even oh. a cold. It was just like it was one of them like everybody finished eating. I mean, it don't bother me. Good. All right, it's one of those things where you like trying to make sure you don't laugh too hard. Type oh, vibe. You oh, feel me? Oh. Yeah. He was out like with the bubble guts. Oh, before one slip out. Bubble guts and runny ass. Oh, okay. That's what you was on. It was bad, bro. Nasty. Like Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Oh, yeah. That's bad. I'm sorry. It was bad. But you had a little a little virus or something. I guess. That's tough, bro. Yeah, that's hard. I'm As sorry. a grown man, bro, yeah, it, ain't, it don't be out here prairie dog and this shit, bro. That's As a tough, grown bro. man, bro, it don't it don't feel comfortable. It ain't no comfortable situation as a grown man. I'm sorry to hear that, bro. What else, bro? I don't know. We can move on. Though. So that's that's how it started. <clears throat> but right before, when did it right before we got here, right, right before mm-hmm. we got here, it ended right before you got. No, here? no, 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 no. I was good Friday. Oh, okay. Friday, like okay. probably like midday Friday. <laughs> I got, you know, I was I was solid. Okay. But today, I'm like, you know, I I'm, 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 I got the little one with me, talking um, old lady in the crib. And I'm just, I'm, I'm putting some stuff in the car. And my sister called me. And my sister called me on some, like, real timid, trying to get information, but wasn't really saying that. So she was like, yeah, how you doing? I was like, I'm, I'm good. Hey, I'm sorry, I'm rude as fuck, bro. How much you want for this gumbo, bro? That was all right, bro. That was all right, bro. I'll pay for that, bro. How much you want, bro? Dog for you? <laughs> oh, shit. It's just fine. No. <laughs> you know it's nah, bro. bro. You got to hit him with the for you price. Yeah, yeah. But, um. So she, she was not a real timid on the she phone. She was real timid ahead, on the phone, she, fam. And like. trying to get out you. So I'm like, I'm like. What's up? Like, what's really going on? Then that's when um, my mom got on the phone and started asking me questions. She was like, so you out of town? I was like, no, I'm, in the, I'm at the house. She was like, you ain't been You call your grandma? I'm like, yo, like, what's what, up? Right. Because now you don't say it, grandma. And all, I'm now, worried, I'm, you know, my, right. nah, I don't went the worst Wait, thing. Or, yeah. Thank you. I'm not the only one. But continue. So she was like, 
So your grandma just called and said somebody called her talking about you were in Alabama, you had an accident, then you got um you got locked up. And um say you all right though, you know, you you was all right, you were talking to her and everything, but yeah, you had an accident. They got you cuz um they locked you up cuz you they caught they say you were drinking. So they had to lock you up. So but they, anyway, she was like it's going to be $5,000 to get you out. And they gave the number to the lawyer. Oh. I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> they scamming. And it like, was elaborate. <laughs> I'm like, what Like, what in the scam is this? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, a super elaborate scam, super fam. Elaborate. Like, super elaborate. Down to the deets. And I'm like, the part that really got me, like, tight was, like, my grandma, 80. You feel me? Uh, so yeah. it's kind of like. You can't put that pressure on her. Like yeah. That. Like, I, I, I told my grandma. I was like, you know, something like that happened. Just call me. Right. But she ain't thinking like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then. Apparently, whoever it is scamming told my grandma was like, "Well, he didn't want he didn't want his wife to know. He didn't want his mama to know. That's why but we that's called how they you." Get him. They, they, they. So she in panic mode. That's fucked up. I'm like, it sound like is we got to ride on some niggas. We got we got to go down there. We got you got my back. I, I want you know. I'm, I'm leading the attack, bro. Don't you talk about bro? <laughs> he the one that introduced yeah, it. He's ready, about, <laughs> bro. I mean, it tripped me out though for real because it's like on some. I, I took it as a joke, but then when I really sat down and, and thought nah, about that's it, that's kind of that's extremely fucked up. Yeah, right. and whoever it is, but they could have gave your grandma a heart attack. Exactly, right? that, and that's exactly. the part. That's the part exactly. that really got me thinking. I'm like, bro, what if my grandma would have clocked out over some information it's, like it's, that? You know what I'm saying? Right? So whoever that is, we on your ass. We on your bumper, bro. Y'all, yeah, I, I find out. Mm. Give me, give me a second through, through Instagram. I find out. We gonna go through the proper channels. Mm-hmm. Instagram, you like a private idol, ain't gonna lie to you. Yes. What you be doing on Instagram? So my weekend was decent. It was cool. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, toss. <laughs> nah, she just diverted, bro. <laughs> she want to ask you a question. Oh, is that what it is? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. No, nah, my weekend was cool. This <laughs> ice in the wild, bro. So you got you got your own tactics. You're a little different, mm-hmm. bro. He a different dude, bro. Thank the, you. You, you, like, you want the ice in your wine? Not really. Not with red, but it's okay. Thank I appreciate you. a different guy over there, man. I appreciate you. Hey, you're like, I mean, God, don't you? Yeah. No, nah, I, I, I appreciate it. It's cold because you keep it in the fridge, not because I particularly like it cold, but I appreciate it. Thank you. True. But yeah, man, that was my, um, that was my week and weekend. Mm. But yeah, that more so, like, we got, I got to find out because that just, like you said, because then it means whoever it is knows your peoples. It was just a little too detailed for me, though. It's like. Nah, but they know your peoples, and that's a little creepy. But, you know, information is information, That's how I too. feel, bro. Like, they know No, you. but I mean, like. They might, they might do. But it the fact no that they random, skip three people. No random got niggas to from gra- New York. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's Boston creepy. Boston somewhere trying right. to down, get some text information. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that sound personal. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's personal, bro. They yeah. called your, they called, they called your, your grandmother. Yeah, grandma, bro. Right. And asked for Justin. I mean, it was talking about Justin, bro. Right. Did they call you by name, or you didn't get that part? I didn't get that those details. I'm oh, sure they it, had it, to. It, though. It, nah, 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 not necessarily. They could have said your so? grandson. Uh, that's what that's, I'm saying. That too. That too. But I mean, just the principle that and, they got that number alone is is enough. And be on some shit like they ain't really have to know everything. Like they, they could have said something about your basis. grandson, and she, his grandma could have been like Justin. Yeah, and, and then got there. I'm more than Anything. can bet that that's probably how it happened. And then as soon as she say Justin, now they got now they the got ball rolling. That's it. Now we cooking with fish grease. Right. Like you don't did this with folks. They done dropped the chicken huh? in there. It sounds like you don't did this. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse <Yeah>. me. <laughs> Excuse I ain't me. Never been no scammer, bro. Now that's scammer, that's a whole nother lifestyle, man. That like real talk, you mess around and scam the wrong person. You gonna die. I couldn't have said it better. I All said right. it for you. <laughs> no, I'm saying like that. You gonna die. <laughs> that's it. Like that ain't you, even a question. Mm-hmm. You fuck around and fuck over the wrong person. It's over with. Facts. For real, for real. So, um Oh, I got questions, bro. Go ahead. So we got my boy L in the building, El Dorado, Terrell Thomas for you know. Nah, nah. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. I said you bro. couldn't talk. You just can't be loud. Did you come up here for a personalized <laughs> ass whipping on this 2K or what? What's going on? Uh, 
Oh. <laughs> he hands them out. Oh. <laughs> Respect. You gotta pause, bro. All that New York shit, bro. Niggas ain't no you don't butt have to pirates around here, bro. <laughs> or the ass will say what I want to say. That's a pause. <laughs> that don't require a pause. Bro, New York niggas pause every third <laughs> word, bro. Right. Every like, third word. I dribble the basketball. Pause, like. Bro, niggas, every third pause. word they pause it's and some okay. shit. Like, you can bro, say dribble God. the basketball. Yeah, like, when the first right. time y'all heard pause? Lighting up, bro. Oh, probably how high some shit. How high? I enjoy the shows. Appreciate, Appreciate it, my boy. That. That's respect. Like I, I, I enjoy your show as well, Thank bro. These are my times on Thursday at uh nine thirty. <laughs> See how that that that's a community right there. That that's we do a live hip hop daily. Look at the live hip hop daily community. That's what they gotta be, family. Bro. Y'all do yeah. ch- definitely check out other community. podcasts on the network. For real, it's a lot of dope talent. Bro, any chance dope. I get, bro, I sh- I'm shouting out niggas, bro. Like for sure. You know well, well, then you gotta let them know that we got two shows up for some awards, some Atlanta awards and some shit too. Oh, uh, do you like me? Yeah. Progress Report and um, Cash Color Cannabis. That's Absolutely. what's up. That's, Shout out. That's, that's, that's what's up. Those, that's and, and the, those, those are one of my favorite shows, moving. too. Yeah, no lie. Especially was, Progress Report. Yeah. Know, I try to make on Wednesdays when I can. I that's mean, dope. I thought you was going to shout out the time, but... No, hmm? did y'all I watch thought you was gonna the shout out the time. Did y'all watch the Oscars? Except, uh, nine, I did not. Nine o'clock. No, I did not watch. The didn't Oscars. watch the Oscars. Uh, Black Panther went shit significant. No, did they, they win won, anything? They won some. I heard it was for. No, they won. Significant awards, costume design, really? Hey, fam. Sometimes, sometimes cliche. you got to get in the door, man. You got to get your foot in the door, man, to do some work. Yeah, what was it supposed to win? Yeah. Best picture. Was it though? Yes, who it won was. best picture? And I, I let you know who won best picture. The Green, Book. Green Book. Oh yeah. Those Green are the Book. movies that win yeah. best picture, bro. Not an action flick. No, Green flick. Book did, did uh, win best picture. He was nominated for best director, but why not best director? Who got nominated for best director? Best, best supporting. Bro, okay, hold, 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 white, hold up. Can I can I can I say, yeah, I can I say <coughs> some can I say some real honest? I mean, I'm not. When the last I time you watched like the the wardrobe on it? I think it was very it was style. The costumes were yeah. good. Yeah, it cost a shit ton of money. When the last time you watched Black Panther? Two weeks ago. Uh, actually, a couple of days ago because yeah, it's on Netflix. Netflix. Was it was it was it, was it a good movie? Yeah, I fucking I watched it on Netflix. Oh, where you going with this, bro? You trying to say Yeah, where we going with this? Yeah, we got a hot take. What we got a hot take? Nah, no, say what you got to say, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is no, no buffer podcast. Hey, I'm not scared. I don't think it was a bad movie. Okay. But I don't think it was like Oscar nominating. It's not an Oscar nominating like best picture film. Respect. I think I think there was a lot of hype behind it. I think we went out and support. I think a lot of not just we, but a lot of people went out and supported the movie. Obviously, it was like. Highest grossing film. The storyline was clear cut and dry. You it was very, like, very. But I don't want to say dry, but you know, it was, it to, was the to the point. Like, yeah, I knew where it was going. <laughs> exactly. Knew, you know what I mean? Like, ooh, ooh, ooh. But, but if you take away, if you take away the Marvel aspect, right? And when I say Marvel, I mean like, I don't know these numbers, but I'm sure forty to sixty percent of the people that went and watched that are Marvel fans. If you take away Marvel fans from that movie, is it the same hype around it? Because yeah, the, well, that's how it got so big. Because mad people who not into superhero shit, okay, see it. I'm with okay. you. I'm with them. I mean, I'm with them. Bro, we've been here. We've been here before. Right. We, we just following the narrative, right? Now, I didn't watch the Oscars at all last night. I didn't watch not one yeah, part yeah. of it. But let me ask y'all this: Was there a lot of um, female-inspired movies? Nominated? Nah. It wasn't? How you know you ain't watch? You was on a hot take. He said nominated, not won. Like female led. Like the, the, the narrative of the movie was based to like cater oh, no, to women. There, there you want to say chick flick? No, no, no. Bro? Was, not, no, not just chick flick. No, there was a it was, I'm asking that because I haven't watched it. I'm asking. That's going to be this for the next one. Wait, do you mean he, that? He said nominated, not nominated, one. No, no, no. He, okay, he asked okay, about okay, nomination. Okay. Oh, you know something? You're right. You're right. This is last year. What, what's the award that happened like immediately? Golden Globe? No, no. What it's it's the other thing for movies, like because as Emmys. soon as Black Pound, no, Emmys is TV. Uh. As soon as Black Panther came out, it got nominated for something. Like it's only like Oscars and the MTV. It's a it's a person name. The Tony or something. Uh, no, Tony is theater. Emmy is TV. What's Tony? Theater. Tony is thought, theater. Yeah. Say, yeah, Tony's theater. It's something else. Like, um, 
This is the Golden Globe. Golden Globes was last night. Is that right? No, no. Oscars. Oscars. Okay, what's the Golden Globes? That's TV. That was in January. But, but you said that's TV. That's TV. No, I think it's TV and because the old people be there. It was something that like as soon it was something Bro, as soon phones, yeah though. somebody yeah somebody looked as soon as um <laughs> Black Panther came <laughs> out it got nominated because like Black Panther came out like <laughs> last year last year but it was something as soon as it <laughs> the sun oh yeah the Sunday it was Sunday something before. big yeah I don't I don't know maybe we have to look at what they want I think we should do a petition oh, boy, to boy. bring back the goddamn Source Awards or fucking Double XL Awards why don't we, we just our create show. our own the platform is dead though yeah, why don't you just create your own platform? Hey, H, here we go. Live Hip Hop Daily. Yeah, award. like, why don't you just. I, I, I could go with that too. Because it's like, I'm sorry. The Academy? No. That's the same. Yeah, yeah. What's the. Yeah, I was going to say it's the same thing. Yeah, what's, the, yeah, what's, the, the what's the Academy Award? Yeah. So did they win? Did Black Panther win anything last year? Costume? Oh, last year, not. For the Academy? No, I thought they did win. Something, they. Bro, I kid, I kid you not. Look for something 2018 or 2017. I don't. I don't know if that's what. A, no, I don't think it was. It was something like white. <laughs> it was something white. Mm -hmm. Well put. <clears throat> All right. So I, I'm wrong. Yeah, I don't Best know. I'm, picture I'm drama. Oh, they was nominated on the. Uh, what I was just looking at, Golden Globes, but Bohemian Rhapsody won it. What the fuck? What and they won. Last night, I heard that movie was actually, but decent. Black Panther was in the running for it. Was I don't know, they don't say they won nothing, though. but Spike Lee won, right? Yeah, he did Word. for Green Book. For Green Book, uh, mm. Spike, Spike Lee, Lee? Yeah. no, it was uh, no. Black Clansman. No, Black Black Clansman. Clansman. That's Spike Lee, yeah, in huh? Green Book. Spike Lee was in, in Green Book. Like, hold on, hold on, no, no, hold on, hold on. What, what do you say? That's what I'm talking about in last year, right. 2019. Okay, so I don't know. Okay, so maybe that's what I'm thinking about. Then I was like, if something else happened, what they would nominate? I thought it was and, close. Yeah, to that. they they won and they was all up there. Uh, that's what I'm saying. It was something that. Maybe that's what I'm that talking about. Like it was something that I I remember seeing. Like it was a collective of people. I was saying. But they gave Spike. An award for his movie. Was it best director? What did Spike get? No. He got like best, best picture or something like that. Screenplay. Yeah. Okay. I don't know exactly what that means. That means because you know when you turn the yeah, book, book into a movie. Right. Okay. Okay. Now, best original screenplay was won by the Green Book. Green Book. Person. Okay. Green the, Book. How can it be original? That's too, right. That, that, that's where I'm going with this. How can it be an original screenplay? That's why I guess they was flipping mm. because he had to change up shit and make his own shit okay. for the movie. Hey, I'm pretty sure it was a screen that this Guild Award for the uh, Black Panther shit because they won outstanding performances. That's what, it, that's, that's what it is. Because that happened last year, right? Like early last year. No, it happened uh, this year. 2019. I mean, but being that we saying last year, we, we really mean. No, I'm saying like when, like when did the awards air? Year. Is what I'm asking. Oh, I don't know. You switching up the narrative. <laughs> Yo, the other thing is that I think that's what it is. About though. all this is say like a Spike Lee and all that. As much shit as he talked about the Oscars for all his career, for them to nominate him and he was so hype. It's like, yo, you really shouldn't even want this award. Because Niggas like winning shit, bro. Yeah. I mean, it, he, he won for some bullshit. But, but, I mean, I, yeah, and, and I. I right. That's my point. Yeah, it is a validation. Career, he was like, fuck that shit. So now, when you get older and you. And then you make some movie that was, uh, if a nigga say like, fuck, it. It, fuck the NBA MVP got them his cold career saying, and he got that win, saying, be like, that shit all politics and you win that shit, that, be like. That, that, that's not the same thing. Why? Because the NBA is giving you that. That's like saying if, um, like the rap shit. Hold on, uh, what you, hold on, I don't understand. They give you awards at the, the Oscars and shit too. Right, but they've been fucking you for all this year, all these years. Well, the same thing could be said about Kobe. Kobe deserved more than, how many MVPs Kobe won? One. He won one, right? 
Like, so we can say the same thing about Kobe. They, like, Kobe got one MVP, they was on bro. some, uh, they was on some pushing the global brand for Steve Nash and Dirt and the Whiskey. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So why do we want these awards? But I'm saying, like, niggas like winning shit, Yeah. Bro. But we know it's bullshit. That's all you got. That stands right behind your name. Some legacy shit. Right. Yeah, legacy, legacy shit. Yeah. That's some bullshit though. I and mean, it's, better, it, it's just what Cheyenne nah, said though. Nah, it, it's leg. It's all look, legacy. I can't wait to live hip hop daily get popping, bro. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see y'all demeanor and shit when we don't have a. There's no hip hop awards though. Is that? Why you don't just create it? BT. Yeah, what's the BET shit? BT, oh, right. That's some new shit. Now, nah, bro, they got podcast awards now and everything. Like, I mean, streamies and all that shit. shit. But my thing is, you, you, you can't. I need the same energy, fam, right. when we win one. Same I need that same one God. when you win one. I don't know. I don't see you. I don't see you shift now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. H, like, ain't you going to the awards? <clears throat> Yeah, that's that's right. You ain't got right. to win when it's right. like that dominated. Yeah, that's the real part yeah. right there. Like now we could get on that too, right? Right? Because Jamie Fox won. Jamie Fox won Best Actor. His career was supposed to take off. What happened after? He that? did. What? Hold on. What film? <laughs> he did. Say, what? After he won. Hold on. Hold on. What film? What film? Listen to me. Hold on. What film did he win Best? Hold on, y'all. Hey, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, y'all. Hold on. Only on mic. Ray, tell me all his movies after that was he. Okay, let's not let's no, not no, guess. No. Let's no, not no, guess. No, no, no. Let's no, no, no. Let's hold on, we, no, we, let's not no, guess. Let's not guess. You said Ray. Hold on, hold on. Let's not guess. Steve, what the fuck are you talking about, bro? Steve, just look it up. Let's not like we 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 can't be like doing blind facts. Like Steve, just look it up. Like, I mean, yeah, he quit to say some blanket. Let's look it up. It's no buzzer, Ray, just he, facts, bro. You fucking up the, the slogan right now. <laughs> if he <laughs> won, if he won the Oscar with um Ray, let's see what he did after Ray. After, all right, tell me everything. Talking about the movies. The movies he did after Ray. All right. Do all right. Jamie Foxx discography. All right. It'll, It'll be filmography. filmography. I mean, you know what I'm talking Cause about. Because discography would be it's al- albums. It'll be yeah, albums because he actually did music too. Oh, Ray was in <laughs> Ray was in two at that. Oh my god, he popped it out. He, uh, Steph Jarhead, Miami Vice, Dream Girls. That was big. Oh, he was in Dream Girls. Is, is he the, the star in Dream the, Girls? The, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Is he the star? Is he getting 20? They not, he's not gonna. Hold on, fam. Hold on. Let me finish the list, fam. That company, the Kingdom Dream Girls, because that's some black shit. The Kingdom, the Soloist, Law Abiding Citizen, Valentine's Day, Due Date. I'm still here. How many you saw? Let's just look at the, look at the big ones, though. Let's look right. At, Jango White House down. Oh, he was yeah. Rio got there, came with that boot yeah, money. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Annie. Uh, Horrible bosses. Uh, Spider Man Two. Robin Hood. Robin Hood was the last film. H over here stuck. No, are these good? What are you talking about? How many? Wait, now you talking? Yeah, I was gonna say you changed the argument. First, you were talking about price. First you were talking about price. Now you talking about being uh, you know the main that, actor, the lead role. Like, you know, he got that Oscar check. He got that Oscar. Yeah, he got an Oscar. He got a he got a check for it. Django got, is his biggest I believe, movie I believe, I believe after that. After after Spider-Man, Ray, he probably got a big check, but these are all shitty. The Spider Man when he was in it was shitty. But your original argument no, wasn't about shitty about, roles. Bro. You were talking about yeah, what the check was. Hold on, like. hold on, hold on, hold on. Now. <clears throat> hold on. Django, he was the. That's his movie. That's his movie, Django. What you mean? That's his movie. Are you? He's the star. Right. Okay, so but we're, we're so what is the movie? It's his movie. No, but what? The white boy is the star. No, Gerald no. Butler is the star. No, he's yeah, you no, have no. a protagonist and you have an antagonist. <laughs> so they were co-stars of the movie. They were co-stars of the movie. You have, huh? Uh, my Oh, no, they were co-stars yeah. in the movie. You have a protagonist and you have an antagonist. When the fucking name comes out, it says Gerald Butler in, not White Boy's Black Tiger. Got more scenes. What about the most scenes in the movie as a man? I disagree. Nah, I'm not. Okay, since so okay, so so I don't know if anybody can hear the background. They probably can't hear it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Time out, time out. If you want to talk, 
You gotta get on the mic. You gotta hit the mic. Because it's gonna make everything sound incohesive. It sounds like we're just talking, talking and nobody can hear what's being said in the background. No, you good. But to the point, I don't know what you're trying to argue. Are you trying to argue his what the money that he got paid after he got that the Oscar, or if you're saying if he had lead roles? As in a Julia Roberts when she won fucking whatever <laughs> shit. Her movie, she was more the star. Did you now, say Julia Roberts? I, I'm just using an example. That's what I remember a woman who I used to watch her movie. You was on that Pretty Woman shit? Nah, I didn't. Pretty Woman. I'm not going to lie. That's, that's probably one of my favorite Julia Roberts. Besides my, my, my best friend's wedding. Look, but Julia Simon. Roberts is on fucking Amazon now. Like, what that fucking award doing for her? She's yeah, on fucking I don't Amazon, know. Like a Netflix, basically, now. Oh, Bird Box. I mean, but but you but that's her I'm that's her lane. Though. Yeah, I'm trying to figure who are they argument. supposed to be? Right now, now right, <laughs> right. We supposed to be. I mean, because if, if acting that, I feel like that was kind of like something he fell who's into. Who's your upper Who's your upper echelon of actors that Jamie Foxx is supposed to be? Quote Denzel. unquote. Denzel's always the star in his shit. Has he won a fucking Oscar? I bet you if he won a fucking Best Actor shit. He did he for did. Training Day. No, he won Best Supporting. And Training Day? Is this facts? Or is this this is this is the buffer we're talking he about? He won Supporting Actor. Hold on. Let's, let's look Hold it on. Up. Let's, let's, let's training, do some research. Training Day. And he wasn't even the star. He should have been the star. But the white boy is the star. No, no, no not in Training Day. Eat the heart, the star? No, 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 no. Time out. Hold on, time hold out. Time out, time out. No. H, H, H. Denzel won Best Actor for Training Day. Not Best Supporting. He won Best Actor. Best Actor. Yes. Fact check. It's, this is no buffer, just facts. So I'm going to need for you to okay. stop saying bullshit. All right. You're fucking up our slogan right now. Listening characters. The main character is whichever character has the most scenes in a film. So if you watching a film, whoever has you, you, you can kind of count it. whoever has the most screen time is the main character. So okay. Even if it's a four group like Hangover, anybody can guess who was the main character in Hangover? The nigga that was getting married. Nah, 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 nah. The dude with the tooth, the dentist, was yeah. the main character for uh for. for oh, the not Doug. Was the main character. He was. He not only did he. Nah, how is he the main? Because he went through the most change. He he was the he was the one who changed the most. Uh-oh. He the one that got Script lost. Script classes. Dude. Let's He's go. The only one who. Out of all the guys that, you know, he's the only one that, remember, at the end, he changed on his wife. He was like, you know, I'm done with her. Oh, yeah. So, he's the only one that really changed his personality. The one, I guess, the one, the character that develops most throughout he the... Grew, yeah, he's the one who grew. We here. What's the other one? We here. I'm working on it. I'm working on something. I'm working on my, on my screenplay shit. That ain't what you were thinking about. No, go over that cap on shit. It. That so you coming go over that cap shit, bro. So you said something. You, you want to think about some shit 20 years before the last movie, bro. Go over that cap shit, bro. <laughs> so, no, I ain't going to so let you do that. So you coming to my script writing event then, right? Oh, absolutely. I'll be there. All right. Let, go, let me know what time go ahead and plug plug it, bro. Go ahead and plug it. Yeah. <laughs> you can't just say it. No. You can't just say it. it. Like, go no, ahead and plug it. it. I, I, we got a few events, and I really couldn't remember the exact date. I would already plug it right in, right in the mix, but I, I believe it's uh, March the twenty fourth. Okay. At seven p.m. Live hip hop. Oh, nice. It's, it's okay. Cool. Sunday. Cool. It ain't no ain't scripts, no really wine, and you. chips. Oh. For sure, for sure. So look, man, we spent a lot of time on that Oscar uh, recap. Sorry. Considering that none of us in here watch it, but one person that's crazy, we was on it for a minute. Right. Huh? Did you say you watched it? No, he didn't watch it. So that nobody in here watched nobody it. Nobody watched like, it. But how the, we spent twenty minutes? Because <laughs> he kept trying to argue it's three arguments at we about one to start. time. We about nah, to I got one more question about this shit. Bro. Here we go. Sorry. I'm sorry. I need some tea. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Who is you expecting goddamn Jamie, Jamie Foxx Fox to, to be, beat, right? Denzel. Oh, he did say Denzel. He said Denzel. But I'm saying, bro, like, they got, like, their plateaus is kind of the same to me. Like, I'm saying, brother had. Are you saying Jamie makes movies like Denzel? Are you kidding me? You think he passed Denzel? You think Jamie he passed Denzel? Fox? See? Are you kidding me? It's all good. I, I like this. Hey. <laughs> no, not career wise. I'm going to tell you why this is not good. What? Because we're not the one doing it. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. I'm saying. I don't, I'm saying I don't we'll know. speak. Yeah. Wait, time out, time out. <clears throat> so what's, so what's time happening out. is. Time okay, out. Hold time on, out, hold time on, out. Time, time out, time out. Time out. We got to keep everybody that's listening informed because no one absolutely knows what the fuck is going on. 
So the argument was H one H was saying that he wanted Jamie Foxx to be at the same level as Denzel. Then we argued who had the better career, and people spoke and said that it was um, Jamie Foxx that had the better career than Denzel. And this is where we're at right now. So That's I where just we're want at. to state right. this. Jamie Foxx, as a director, Jamie Foxx is a way better actor than Denzel Washington will ever be. Because Jamie, Jamie Foxx can do way more things when it comes to acting. He's been comedian. He's been serious. He's been... Denzel plays the same few roles. He has more range. We're saying he has... Yeah, he has more range, you know right. And it's Denzel, not really and, false. And, and it's not false. And not to mention that, without Spike Lee, there would be no Denzel. So you had the the, the, the director who's going to automatically put you in any role that you that you, you know that you play in. That you feel. Right off the rip. Right. Jamie Foxx, no. It's all my talent. That might be the case, but Jamie Foxx no, 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 no. okay. Jamie Foxx has held his own by without himself and, and we multiple directors. This movies, works great for that's a live show, but yeah. not for the podcast. But I'm saying, <laughs> <laughs> it don't. I'm just keeping it real with y'all. About if it take a, without feel, there's no Michael. My bad. My bad. <laughs> 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 My bad. But I'm saying, <laughs> what? I'm saying he ain't saying nothing wrong. But I would agree, Denzel has way better films. Yeah. No, I mean, but I, I feel like that's also subjective and opinionated. I don't, oh, so I don't think there's uh, no wrong or right answer. Denzel has a better agent then. No, I'm no. saying he, he has. We, we introduce a new stuff Yo, that doesn't you, make what's, sense. What's your he, argument like? He, like you need yeah, to what, find what one and stick to it. So he be got. No, no, he says he, that, he says, says Jamie Foxx is a way better actor than Denzel. Think of a Jamie Foxx movie that's bigger than Denzel. Yeah. Oh. Django. Denzel, listen, y'all think Denzel. I'm sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. Ray. American Gangster. Like, here's the thing, right? Ray is bigger than American Gangster. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, besides Ray. Yeah. Bro, don't change the dance. So you said well, I could. Hold on, hold on. Here you go. Miami Vice. It's bigger. It grows more. Then what? That shit was terrible. If it was bigger, people would have went to see this shit. It grows more. Meaning that people went to see it. Because who's in it? You didn't see it, Colin obviously. Farrell, the white boy. Yo, how? That's my point. How you? Hey, it's, it's like you. Hey, we moving on. Us. Was probably the uh, some of the high the top movies that Denzel <clears> has <throat> done. These are recent. If you talk about prior to the in Training Day, so so these are prior to that. You got Denzel and Spike. Most of the movies are Denzel and Spike. You got Law by a Citizen. You got the Django. You got the Marvel movie. You got you got a bunch of movies then, uh, that Jamie Foxx done been in and held his own in by himself. All right. Just acting. So cool. What we're going to do is, Jay Black, if you don't mind, can you look up those numbers? We're going to move on from the subject, though. We'll, we'll recap this later on because we've been on this for like way too long. I'm going to step in as producer right now and be like, Ooh. we're going too far. Like, we've been Father on for like Goody 30 minutes. He came in with his foot down. Told you I like, legit. Bed, put your pajamas on. It's bedtime. No, it's, I mean, we're putting pressure on us. It's, it's no pressure, bro. We, we, <laughs> we've been doing this for a while. No, real talk, though, but, um, I just want to know, we, we got to talk about R. Kelly. We got to talk about Robert Kelly. And uh, what's the other Kelly? Um, the, uh, Robert Kraft. Kraft. Yeah. The other Robert. The other Robert. Robert Kraft. Yeah. And um, I feel like. Who, who we start with, Robert Kelly? The R, the Pied Piper of R. We saw this happening though, right? I mean. It's, it's, it's overdue. It's like long overdue. Yeah, I feel like it's long overdue. <clears throat> I didn't. You didn't think you didn't think he was gonna get him? Uh, no, cause they. I mean, I, I felt like they would they would have went to the authorities before they made a documentary and went right. to some filmmakers. Right, right, that too. And went to some who? Before film they went to makers. the filmmakers. Let me get oh. this check before we. Get when I this heard it. somebody made a good point, they said that the reason that they made the movie was because was, of course they had a non disclosure, and in order to pay for the you know the I guess the footage the contract they made a movie to get, get paid. Get it paid. And I wouldn't doubt that's it. That's a good. He's out now. He made bail. Yeah, he made like bail. Thirty uh, earlier today, he made bail. Oh, he didn't get out. He said he got one hundred sixty-five thousand child support. Oh, yikes! Oh, they got him for child support. <laughs> oh, he ain't going back. Yeah. So this is this is this is what I think is happening though. Like right now, R. Kelly is getting the OJ effect. You know how we're OJ, not gonna get you for this, but we gonna get you for OJ this. got off on murder. Yeah, it is what it is. But we're going to get you for this. It's like, no, bro. <laughs> but wait, Tom. You're right. I'm, we I'm don't know. I'm still mad. But what we do know is he, he, he was found out guilty, guilty, right? That too. So if you get found <clears throat> out guilty for like one of the biggest crimes ever, murder, I think you should just kind of lay low. But he not. 
the average person gonna lay low, right? But we talking about the pot pipe of R and B. I don't don't it's call not, him that. That's not even. We should not say that. That's that's his and the name, name is in itself. It's, I know, but nasty. we should we shouldn't even say that. Bro, but the fact that everybody was like, "Yeah, it's the pot pipe ring," and people let him go off on in the studio like he said it with that mask, like, "Yeah, I'm the pot pipe of R and B," and people was like, "Yeah, that's what's up." Mm-hmm. They let him rock. No, I wasn't expecting him to get um indicted on anything. So that I'm not gonna say it was surprising. I just thought it was kind of like a too little, too late ordeal, but. Um, I mean, you. Know, I feel like it is what it is with him at this point. Like, I don't feel like it's it's a matter of debating on who gonna rock with him or who not, who's gonna listen to his music, who not. I feel like people gonna do whatever because people are people. But um, I, f- I, f- I do feel like it's fucked up that all this time people's been saying and hearing the same things and it's just not happening. So is he gone? <clears throat> I don't think so. You think you you think he gonna get off again? Well, you know what? I can't really say. I feel like the climate is a lot different right now than what it was 20, what, 30 years ago when, when all this stuff started spiraling. It's been 30. 20, well, it's just, been 30 I'm, years I'm saying now. 20, 20, 30, give or take five. Okay. But I know the climate is different. You know, we're, we're really big on advocacy and into big... Um, into into things like this, like big discussions, the Me Too movement, child pornography, you know, that whole thing. So, I, I don't know. I feel like it can go either way. I don't know. I don't know if I have enough energy to kind of put in, into it anymore. I, I think I'm kind of over it. <laughs> I think that's the sentiment, too. When he got arrested, I, I think a lot of people was like, okay, finally. I feel like that's kind of what he's on. Like, I feel like it's kind of why he was just chilling, like. All right, y'all pull out the doc. All right, cool. All right, y'all, that's what y'all gonna do. All right, cool. Like, I don't feel like he really was kind of expecting anything either, but I don't know. No, uh, it's it's it's. I been feel like past it's nasty time. either way. But so the thing that really got me about the second time is that wh- who still has the VHS tapes? What you mean? They were saying that they found him this time on another VHS tape, and I'm just thinking, oh, who the fuck got a VH? Like, who has a a video player? Like. I'm sure that's some old footage. I wouldn't be surprised if that's like one of the tapes that they. Yeah, yeah. One of the other mini tapes that he probably got. Kills. I don't know. I mean, good luck to him. I guess. I don't know. More power to him. (laughs) More power to him. I ain't gonna say I'm gonna keep him in my prayers because. No, no, we ain't gonna go that far. That's for you and God. I wanna. I really want to get on the um. The Robert Kraft situation, because on on one hand. There's the um, billionaire just, you know, paying for him some. And then you have the other side, that the sex trafficking part that they bring it in. And so I don't know if it's, if it, I don't know if it's really like sex trafficking. I don't, I don't know. <coughs> well, we got a German got a shepherd on the side. What's right. going on? Big wheel dog. <laughs> big wheel dog should be signing. That boy still. That is big wheel? Oh. oh. It does sound like a grown man. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I feel like niggas been paying for pussy for years, so. Oh, um, what's wrong? No, that's decent. Thank you. What'd you think, Steve? <clears throat> on Robert Kraft. He, oh, not he, Kelly. He gave me that look like, huh? <laughs> where, where, where are we? What on Robert, on Robert Kraft. Robert Kelly, Kraft. About paying for prostitution. Come pussy. on, bro. You know he ain't finna get indicted on no shit, bro. Well, they say it was misdemeanor charges, though, right? Yeah, like because it was it wasn't him, it was him soliciting prostitution. So he didn't solicit anything. He went there to handle. Business. No, no, no. They but, said he got a. <laughs> <laughs> we know that, but the reports say it was solicitation of prostitution. We know why he does. Uh, does any Florida team play the Patriots? Right. Dolphins. The Dolphins. The yeah. Dolphins. That's one of the reasons too. They said we we tired of get the Patriots kicking our ass. So we go dirty up that nigga just because. Did you see the way his mouth looked? Just did what he said. When he said dirty up, <laughs> that came from the good. Right, he felt it on the, the inside. No, no, yeah, no. he's not doing no time. They was buying some ass, bro. That's, but that's that's but look, honestly how I feel about it. But but I was listening to the radio and the dude was like, he had to have known that it was like some sex trafficking shit going on, like. I don't know about How does he know? that. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't. I think he like um, way too far removed to even 
to know, like, oh, yeah, that's a like, sex thing. I think it's like a care thing. Yeah, I think it's like. I got too much, man. I don't give a fuck. Oh, right. They over there? Okay. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. yeah. He, I don't think he knows. I legit think it's just like that. Every day I pass on north side, y'all yeah, know. Damn, I don't really want to say where it's at. But I drive on this highway, this street, mm-hmm. every day, and I be looking at some small shit that be like, this shit don't belong here. It don't even fit the fucking. It just look, it look out of place. Yeah, like, what spot we talking about? Spot, huh? Looking out of place. We tell you off camera, God. But. <laughs> <laughs> we can't get one landmark. Yeah, a landmark. Oh, a landmark is um. That's all damn, we we looking for the exact street name. Looking for landmark. The, um, damn, what's the name of this, the sex shop shit over here? Oh, the old okay. insurrection. Is that what we talking about? Tokyo. Tokyo right. Oh, right. To- oh, oh yeah, you Tokyo Valentino. Tokyo you go a few shits down, you be like, what the fuck is going on? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah, with, yeah. A small with tinted windows. What the fuck is this? Hey, like, low key, all awesome. those, all those spas be having no tinted windows Folks, though. You go to what's the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can't remember the franchise. Oh. All the ones at the shopping center got the tinted windows, Thanks. bro. Oh, I don't, I don't remember the name. Of <laughs> you go, you go, you go in the med spa and um. <laughs> Oh, you going to spa Sardell. That's why that's why you ain't saying no tinted windows. Massage envy. Massage envy probably. Yeah, they bro. No, bro, cause you come on, bro. We talking about. <laughs> what are you talking about? You okay? I'm gonna give I'm gonna no. give you the equivalent of what you said, right? Right. right. So like spa Sardell, massage, massage envy. envy. Those places would be McDonald's. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. no. Those would be like Roof Chris, right? Like. Your steakhouse, right? The spots that Robert Kraft got found in, right? That's kind of, that's that's like that's like a spot on old Nat. Somebody auntie just opened up. Talking about, <laughs> I got 30, steaks for the about low. twenty dollars an hour massage. You know what I'm saying? Like that. That's a five dollar steak versus a fifteen dollar steak or fifty dollar steak. Excuse me. Okay. That's the difference. All them spots with the tinted windows. I don't know I if it. Go in. That you should know where you go in. Come on. I feel you. I ain't gonna lie to you. When I saw the footage of the spot, I was like, "Bro, you got too much money to be so going up in this spot." Right. What are you talking I ain't even. About? But we that. also he went in that spot to get him some trim, bro. So I was like, "That's why he was in there." Yeah. yeah. That's all. I'm an older man. I'm gonna be in there about 20 minutes. I'm good. I want to know yeah. what he had on. Was it? <laughs> know what he had? On. Did he have on a suit or did or he go in there? Sweats. <laughs> he was in that low pro. Yeah, he was in that low pro. He was out here butt booty. He was bucket. out here butt, butt, butt booty. Bucket. Yo, bullshit. On the TMZ shit, they read the whole report, and it was like the nigga that was ill is the the report has nobody named. So that's another shit that's foul. The report has nobody's name. It's just man one, man two, and they said none of these men had vaginal shit with the with the with the girls. So now it just makes my mind be like, oh, so Robert Kraft was fucking allegedly on the wall getting the fucking shit up his ass, or he just gets going, you know? Right, so he look like he a little free, like he want yeah, the hot wax I on mean, his back. Yeah, that's crazy. He probably, I, I know I, they put I, the hot I, wax I, on his back. I, and shit. I understand, oh, and I think about oh. about all people with <laughs> the hot with wax on his back and shit. Money, they into a different type of kinky. Their nah, kinky is way I different. Don't give a fuck. How much money y'all got? Nah, I nah. love some goddamn pussy. Okay? Okay? You, <laughs> what? Wait. <laughs> it's yeah. Wait. Hey, look, the first thing I thought about when I heard it was like Rush Hour 2. You know how I hit yeah. 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 right. yeah, Let me get her. Let me her. get her. <laughs> I can get her too. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that is exactly what I thought. Oh, of. man. Hey, talking about <laughs> that's some like I heard a number a little I, meal ticket like yeah I, it, I, I'm get this off bro like I mean first off like we talking about Robert Kraft right like so it, the worst thing he's not going to jail like Steve's like, he's not going to jail no, he's like jail facts what facts. they might force him to sell the Patriots that's not gonna happen <laughs> at, at best what will, will, will happen he'll probably really? get like a huge fine from the uh, NFL oh and like. Oh, Cause he's uh, what's the shit? What's the rule they got now? You fucking up the fucking um. They image basically or whatever. Like I was, I was watching first take, and they were pretty much saying like they, they're they, the owners take you know 
they're they're the owners. So like they got to punish them as harsh as they would punish the players because like you own the team. So uh, basically, so like you two grown. You know what I'm saying? It's like your your mama say like you two grown. Don't even think he's you doing get that? Cause, um, no, bro, he gonna get that. What's the cowboy dude? Jerry Jones. He, he got caught up in some shit. They ain't find him in no shit. It was a right? different time. Like the climate right now. I'm it's just like, saying, yeah, bro. Like, if you walk away as a billionaire owner and like soliciting prostitution and then they talk about sex trafficking, bro, he gonna get yeah. He definitely gonna get. He probably gonna get about like 750 rats taken Yo, from him. Really, really it's not. Happened. It's minuscule. <laughs> this, really this, really this really happened because he was fucking with hip hop and meat milling. Is that is that a conspiracy? And motherfuckers is mad and said you go dirty up. You that think nigga now shit. that's why that happened? <laughs> Yo, he's tight. Hey, Yo, the way his mouth was when he said looking, dirty, hey, like hey, that's your, he's very <laughs> passionate about this argument. H from a different time that's period, boy. He was like, sound like they doing that because the niggas who's prosecuting them got some shit they be doing too, nigga. So it's like, yeah. yo, they should have some type of sympathy. This nigga is like, crazy. Like, yeah, man. Kill nobody. Got some trend. We go dirty up that nigga, God. <laughs> Nasty. 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 They got, seeing, they got tired of seeing that championship chain. He was rocking from Meek Mill. They said, ooh. And he dancing. Ooh. And they fun. said, ooh. And they like, oh, we got, we go dirty that nigga shit up. <laughs> No, I want to see you when you mad. <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, we, we need a camera on you. You sound like, like Rage. I'm going to smack that nigga up, fool. Bro. <laughs> it was that championship chain. How that shit be shining and shit. Them niggas is mad. Hey, let me. let me. <laughs> he going to apologize for being a broke ass bitch ass nigga. <laughs> hey, let me play something for y'all real like. quick. I don't know if y'all heard this or not. I don't know if y'all heard this. Old. This is Jaru, by the way. At a halftime show, we walked. Nah, I did. What halftime show? The Bucks. I guess not. I guess, I guess not. not. That's stupid. Your man, job. yeah, you were performing at a halftime show at the Milwaukee Bucks. I game. seen some shit the other day. Oh well, well when that happened, mm-hmm. that boy Giannis walked out again. These jumpers in, yeah, yeah, in the jump show. <laughs> show. Straight up, bro. That boy hey. walked straight to the free throw line. <laughs> Ain't nobody paying attention. Why, right? Why you performing on the court? On the court. Bro, that shit was hilarious. He had bro. court, bro. Trash. That yeah, shit was of course, bro. He had no interest in that concert, bro. At all. Now, ja, uh, I can hear that nobody else had. Who, who, uh, who the fuck is Jaru? <laughs> uh, who the fuck is Jaru? Who gives a fuck what Jaru wants to take the time like this? <laughs> oh, he's big here. He's big here. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much. <laughs> My nigga, yeah, this talk just like <laughs> Not so much. These people here, they ain't paying no nah, shit. He, he walked nah, out in the middle. It goes with what we say, like how we said the OJs and the R. Kellys, they know when they're in a situation. It's time to fall back. Don't, we don't need the to who and the arcade. Wait, wait, well, yeah, the who? Who we who, who just got caught up in some shit? We just said. Oh, I thought you said the OJs. OJ, you OJ. OJ. Simpson. Oh, you said oh, fall oh, back. Okay. Up I'm thinking of no, 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 no. Don't group. say the R, the OJs. It's OJ. Oh Simpson. yeah, yeah. Because OJs, that's an R and B group too. Oh, Rental James. Yeah, absolutely right. Yeah, yeah. James. Orenthal is that nigga name. That that contest that was crazy. He's in some shit right now. Yeah, yeah. Sit, fall back. Don't, if they was paying you, you don't need that money, nigga. Fall back. Well, I, Jaru in some shit right now because of the little fire, fire, fire like, festival. Yeah. Yeah. I just watched. He ain't in that much shit other, though. Obviously, he is. You just see. You just, <laughs> you just, I don't think he in that much shit. Now, I, I think I think the people just no, no. I'm not I'm not saying not that legally. that didn't happen, but let, to be honest. He's not in that, in that nigga shit. Passionate. He's not in jail. <laughs> he got a lot of passion. He, he out here doing halftime shows. He, he, he just pretty saw decent. what happened at his halftime show. He's, he's fucking up his. Yeah, before, I mean. Before this happened, him and Ashanti were doing their songs. <laughs> J Lo was. J Lo was. Yeah, I was going to say they yeah. was on tour. But the thing oh, is, though, like, he can't fall back too far, though, bro. Because if he fall yeah, back too far, where you going? He don't need to come out with no new music to do a tour. Yeah, he don't need new music. He already ja got Icon coming out. Ja Rule had the hit. He's still with yeah. the Icon. Doing, when you say tour, he's doing a, a club or something. He's not yo. We Bro, what's wrong with getting your bread? I'm not saying that. Now you can't. He just went and got bread. I mean, but who's no, really? Huh? I mean, let's be honest. Do you really think Ja Rule right now can, can fill up Lakewood? No. Him and Ashanti? 
I'm saying you saying he out here just doing it's clubs like other people. even just say right, okay, okay be like the fox or some shit. Yeah, so I can see him doing a tabernacle. Probably tabernacle, yeah. But tabernacle. okay, but right, but he. So now you in this situation don't come out because you gonna get. No, nah, he's but to be, still visible. But that shit happened like what three, four years ago. To be fair though, to be fair, he did get oh, the booked. fire shit happened yeah, three, four years ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. But they, oh, you I know, they made recent shit. No, nah, they just made the documentary like three, four years ago. The documentary. Yeah. Oh. But even okay, but even still, yeah. the people that that. Knew of that festival, knew that he was a part of it. So why even we, if that was the case, he sh- really that was when he should have laid. Why we just not talking about it? Though? Ain't nobody say nothing when it happened. They yeah, they did. did. That's what they I'm did, saying. But they did, but the documentary just new light. It's about the visual. Once you see it, just like how right. now we know about R. Kelly, but when now right. we watch the women and, and you see what the fuck they right, say. Right, right, yeah. right. Yeah. Oh, no, because it was it was definitely you something. Like, you sound like an old lady, bro. Who? You. Hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hey, but no, what I was gonna say, like, to me, bro. like to be yeah. fair though, like R. Kelly, I mean, not see, man, you talking about R. Kelly, not R. Kelly. Um, ja Rule did get booked to, to perform at halftime. He's supposed to say no. Why? I'm no, the, I'm not in the people, bro. He's not. You're gonna, yeah, yeah, no, like, you you gonna have us missing out on a lot of bread, my nigga. You gonna have us missing out on some bread, bro. I see it right now, bro. You gonna have us missing out on yeah. some bread. Bro. No, no, what, what Black just said is true, though. Like, yeah, he, he's yeah. used to, like, he's not going up. Yeah. what I'm saying. Like, he's not. He's still doing shit. So, if he lays low. It's a different time now. But if he lays low. now. But he, but it ain't like he was missing bread right after that. Oh, oh, why, why do I know some halftime shows, shit? be bro? I don't know. Oh, like if you had paid. to guess, I, I know you don't know. No, I don't know. Oh, okay. How much? Depending on the artist, right? Okay, Montez Jordan was in. Uh, he probably got five to a thousand. I was gonna right? say, bro, he didn't get that much. Yeah, yeah, Montez yeah. Some Jordan tickets. Didn't I was about to say. <laughs> Montez probably got maybe two. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, say what? Say what? Say what? Say what? Faces. Yeah, I'm Jordan. Montel Jordan. Montel Jordan. Me and my people. I think we get like a twenty, bro. I think we can get a stack for doing. You fair? You tell, bro. I'm cut up like that. Cut up. Okay, with the two step. Steve nasty with the two step. I'm cut up out there for the step, though. Yeah. Nah, I'm thinking they get like a ten, fifteen. I think it's. I think it's the like Ray. Ray yeah. Schremer probably got that. At least a five. And a jersey and a tour in the locker room. Wait, wait. Because you're right. It is. It's quick though. But does it depend on the game? On the particular game as well? Like who's playing? Could be. I would think so. I guess the more people that are. So what we're saying is, Ja Rule probably got about two to five grand. That's in this climate, the nigga need it. He ain't doing shit else. I bet you after that. We ain't gonna see him too much. He gonna let shit die down. No, he not. No, in he today's time, you gotta keep going, bro. He not, yo. He got a low key. He got his, bro. Yo, he to me, he's a legend. H, why you acting like he don't have an entire another app in? I I know that. Yeah, but why are you acting like? But why are you acting like you don't know that he got a whole nother app? It is. It's embarrassing. Yes. He got a whole nother app in company called Icon Out. Who gonna fuck with it now? Nobody. No. But that don't mean. Pe- but that don't mean people ain't fucking with him. That don't mean people ain't fucking with him. No, right. That means we not fucking with you. It's funny. Not fucking with It's funny, but he he definitely should. <laughs> no, I don't think he should. I don't think like ain't no. It, there's no benefit for a Ja Rule to that fall back, and like from performing. And the reason why is because Ja Rule is not making new music. If he was a new artist, like if he, if if something like this, if this same thing happened to J Cole, then I would say J Cole will fall back because J Cole is constantly making music. I even think if he was putting out new music, then that would be different. But he's right. rocking off the same shit. Yeah, he's so just he, doing he doing he his not, own stuff. He's not stepping on no on new toes. He ain't trying to gain no new. He just happened. Fans. He happened to go to a game. He happened to perform at a game where where it was probably Milwaukee too. That's a, you gotta go with the state. Well, no, I mean that's Middle honest. America though, bro. Like that's where his fans probably but at. Even still, let's be honest. Middle like, America, bro. The whiteies. way the documentary. Yes, is, do you know? Whiteies is the people who got fucked. First off, let's say white people. Right. <laughs> of course. Okay. Yo, we ain't getting no responses, my nigga. But not. But let's be honest. The way the documentary set up, it's not like they put. 
I'm not saying that his name isn't in the documentary, but all the heat did not fall solely on Ja Rule either. It fell on Ja Rule and that dude. The nigga got like, what, three years though, didn't he? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Six six years. But what's ill is the reason why is because when you watch the documentary, Ja Rule was the reason why they was giving this nigga the money because Ja Rule is the nigga who know all these artists and can do this. So they use Ja Rule. But no, 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 no. I, I do want to ja Rule to the mean. They was with it. They I do want to say I want to say this though. Like we got to keep in mind, we got to keep in mind. Like Black said a while ago, with these documentaries, they spin the narrative the way they want you right. to see it. So the way the narrative is spinning the documentary, Ja Rule can still go out here and perform. Obviously not. Yes, he can. He just did. He just did to the fans. To the fans. No, 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 you, no, no, no. See, hey, what you missing right, is I'm talking about the the people that the spending the money on him, not not yeah. the fans. Oh, this yeah, oh my. He's still God. gonna go and get Yo, the. Where you, we you tell him to That's stop getting the bag. The like time. people still gonna pay him to perform. Wait, good money. We always say good money. Uh, Yo, good money ain't good money. Hey, but hey, that, real but, quick, yeah. Why we always arguing with Ace, I don't bro? know. Yo, I, was, I, I, was, I was really about to Y'all know up, this nigga with the, with the but lunch bag stuff in high school. I feel like you're speaking for the fans, and I'm saying as far as his bag goes, as long as people still spending money on him and he's still getting booked for tours, that shit don't matter. I get where you're going, but they don't give a fuck because his name isn't solely attached to it. He was more so half of a face to something that was put together from the documentary. Even, even to the John Ruben fans. For him to be going through this shit, I'm taking every bag because if niggas feel like I'm, I'm not credible, right? Right, exactly, right exactly, like, exactly. So I get where you're going. You speaking for the fans, like yeah, he yeah, his reaction sucks with fans, but as far as him getting money, if he's still touring, if he's still right. booking shit, yeah, he's gonna show up. I don't, I don't give a fuck what the audience gotta say. I'm still at when I leave, I'm still getting a bag. Right, bro. I'm done arguing that with you. Last, this is the second shit today that you done just <laughs> fucked up. You got my buzz all fucked that up. That last. First of all, it's never an argument because I love all of y'all. We are debating. You can argue and love somebody, yeah, bro. No, no. See, argue, that's a. Argue, argue with the certain words. You know, it's a debate. We're debating. We that don't mean. That's I can, an argument. No, you can still that's, that's argue. A, that's another word for argument. I can still argue. You want to go to the You want to go to the Webster? Ooh. Hit him, Lingo Steve. Oh, go to the Webster. Go ahead and pull it up. Man, we arguing bro, and tomato, right now, man. and you tomato, always tomato. seem to lose. But look, it's tomato, tomato. That's just like okay, Ti or uh, that that restaurant Ti had where nine his name two was five, a, which is now the Oak. That shit was trash, super trash. But I, I think it was just his name attached to it. He ain't even had he, nothing to do with he it. Shit do with it. Speaking of speaking of Ti, rest in peace to Ti's sister. Yes. Oh, she passed. Yeah, she, yeah, did she did pass. pass. Yeah. She, she passed. passed. Yeah, she, yeah, she passed. Did so pass. rest in peace, Ti's sister. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, she was in a car accident. She wasn't sick. No, she was in a car accident. See, niggas be lying. Somebody told me she was sick. Hey, man, you can't believe everything people. You can't believe everything you hear. That was the moment of silence that we. Yeah, that was it. That was it. We just, just, just keep on, just go. We're not even going. Y'all ain't coming that travesty shit, bro. That, that Fuck a nigga mood up for the rest, for the duration of the show, bro. You always come with that. Trip. All right, well here, here goes some. Though. Here's some uplifting stuff, right? So look. Um, oh, I ain't finna what I was talking about. Okay, I'm sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> nigga will finish with his point. Where you at with? So it? with Ti <laughs> restaurant, that shit was trash. But I guarantee you, open up another restaurant, niggas gonna fuck with him. Mm. Is there a movie about it? And you can see, and then you'll see shit, and you have an opinion. No, it's not. A- no, you can go so read. I got an opinion on the shit now. I was gonna say was you can, it was trash. You can go read the. You can it's go read. The, same as the building was beautiful though. Right. Nice the building's a great spot. It's no, yeah, the oak. If, yeah, it's I, called I the haven't oak. been. I haven't it's been to the club. Uh huh. No, I mean shit. Why do people gotta have a movie? If you just go read the reviews and and read the news reports. That's and that was a big building. Too. I feel like he like way too invested. And she said niggas are gonna read the article. Oh, you're a visual person. Where the fuck is that going on? Stop. You're stop. a visual person. Stop. He, he got picture books, bro. I read. If it, you're if a visual it, person. If it wasn't for the fiery fest, he'd probably you still be fucking with Ja Rule. That's, that's, that's what your daddy read. would tell your teachers. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's just a visual person. <laughs> <laughs> he's a visual learner. <laughs> Do you have the... Hey, remember the squares when you was mm. learning how to count? You had the blocks. You, you needed those. The individual oh, blocks. The in the tens. The books. I, I read. That shit... Who don't? The people they be, the majority of the eight the, oh. the era we in now. Oh, oh. she had my eyebrows raised. Oh, baby. let's okay. So I I do have a, I do have something to say about this. So let's get into like 
Let's get into trash shit that that nigga say. What you got me a used cup of uh, black? <laughs> What the fuck is this? You got some, you got dip that was unintended. Oh, that's like some granola shit, bro. Like, what the fuck is this shit? I'm, I'm done, bro. I'm was done. that at the like bottom of the chips eat. or something? Bro, I don't know, bro. I mean, you halfway there now. Yeah, I will finish the cup. It Probably it was it was the packet of the um sour cream and onion or something. He tried to poison me, bro. Tried to hit you up. But no, so Wait. I have so I have this thing, right? Uh-huh. So. You stupid. So, so how can you do so you just call him good? Like, mm, gross. You tried to poison him. He went trying to But no, so I have this thing. So I, as black women, you know, we like to switch up our hair very often. Me in particular, maybe every two weeks. So. You get your hair done every two weeks? I switch my hair up every two weeks. Oh, it's almost a wig shit? Either or. I do my hair, I wear a wig, or I'll get it done. Shut up. <laughs> <Uh-oh>. <laughs> you said you weren't going to say shit on this podcast. I am. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's um, some nervous, right? You sound so nervous. <laughs> uh-huh. well, no, so, I, so recently, I've had this thing happen to where when I wear my hair or I have a fro out, I'll get this same dumbass remark where a male passenger will get in the car and they'll go, oh, man, you know, you just look like you like different and me being the asshole that i am i'm like oh what's different you know like you just like different stuff what's different stuff don't fault you don't know what to say bro no bro oh, but it's always no. the same shit oh you know you like jazz and poetry I mean, oh, you, yeah? you can get that vibe with the hat going no bro. this, right, this is that. even this is without the hat <laughs> this is without the hat or then they'll go, so you look like you read books. I'll be like, oh, yeah? And they be like, yeah, you know, I like to read, too. So then I hit them with, what was the last book you read? I mean, shit, you know, I ain't. So what what exactly are you trying to get? I just told, I just summed it right on the <laughs> No. He trying to holler at you. No, yeah. no. My thing is, no, no, no. The last book you read, and you go, I'm, I'm reading your. I could, re- I could respect the game, but if you just go, shit, you know, I ain't read in a minute. It's just like now you're just out here saying shit for no reason. Yeah, so yeah. So we, yeah. I, I'm just trying to acknowledge these trash ass pickup lines. Like, oh, I, I you like you have, wearing your fro. Segment. You, you should know, have a segment with that. With trash ass pickup lines. You might as well. Oh, you, you know, that many. This shit's awful. You gotta go into the black book. Oh, here it go. But what's your DM looking like? Every week. Well, I haven't posted in a while, so my DMs kind of very light. Okay, so now they so dry. They're, They're down the very street, dry. Walking down the street, you can't tell. I them. haven't walked in Every a while, co- but oh, no, 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 not not even, huh? <laughs> no, no, that I said I haven't walked in. It's been a little iffy outside. So you got to get the gab over there. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean just in the car alone, I'll get the you know I like what you're doing, Queen, with your with your fro, you know I like the natural. My nigga L witty. You know I that I get that thing all the time. Mm. Is this person that in his car? No, no she did when she. Bro, you know what's going on, bro? Stop mm. all that, bro. I'm outside of this nigga, bro. Stop with all that but shit, Steve, bro. You know what the Steve, fuck she do, bro? I started off. I started yeah, that passengers, bro. I, thank you. I started off this whole segment with saying when people get in my car. I, I said that. <laughs> you don't listen. What is up with you? Yeah, bro, I'm bad on that. I didn't no, you good. No, no, no. Shit. <laughs> nah, bro, no if I'm oh, getting bro. in somebody's car, that means they're well versed enough to know not to what say no dumb shit car? like that. Boy, y'all stupid. No, no, exactly no. What she do. Oh, no. man. I didn't, I didn't hear that part. God, it's all nice. good. It's all good. But no, I'm just saying we got to stop with these trash ass pickup lines. We got to be a little more creative no, like, or a little more good. intuitive in, into what, what, what you're trying who? to get at. On, on average, on the week. On day, average, too. probably like five a day. A day? Yeah. Popping, she popping. Not, she popping. She popping. <laughs> she popping. She popping for real. Like, I, I mean, that's question? a light day. Uh-huh. Why do you Depending on what it is. Why do, why, do you feel, why, why do you feel you have to change up your shit every two weeks or whatever? I don't feel the need to. I just personally like to. 
Thank you. I, uh oh, pickup line. Ooh. I didn't want to call into that because I mean, like, no, I mean, I just no, just so me. I'm not. I I like to to switch it up that? a little bit. It's not. I'm not doing it for anybody else but myself. I'm it's with my you. I'm with you. I'm with you, Shane. But yeah. why, why? as men out here, we tired of the creative players, bro. That's cool. No, I understand. I understand. Natural. No, I understand. No, but and I'm not even saying that I that I even like this is just for the camera. But on the regular, like I'm not wearing makeup. So you chilling? Yeah, like I'm, and even on my regular, it's like. You know, I don't know. I just, I, I feel like we just gotta stop with the trash pickup lines. Like, let's just go take it out of day What's by the day. What's the trashiest one you got this week? I ain't gonna say all the time. I'm gonna say this week. Um, <laughs> <laughs> get off me, get off me, get off me, get off me, get off me. Go ahead, bro. I'm just watching that right. map book. I hope nah, it don't fall. Talk, though, because uh, I ain't gonna say what you just said was bull crap, but I, I'm gonna give you another viewpoint from, from my standpoint. I feel like a lot of women, it's only a trash pickup line based on who is telling you the pickup line. Like, if it's a dude that's, you know what I'm saying, that you already found attractive already, you ain't really listening to his pickup line as much as you probably would have listened to it. So, you like, he can who say you feel something like I gotta try harder. He can say something, he can say the same, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And, like, and you'd be like, that's right. yeah. not you, but, you yeah. know what I'm saying, in general. So, I just find that. You know what I mean? A lot of times he ain't really your flavor, so at the end of the day, you ain't really, you know, you're not it's trash automatically. He brings up a good point. No, I understand. That was a good one. That no, was good. I understand that too. It was no cap in this rap right there, man. No. None. Go. But I feel done. like once you've heard it fifty million times, it's like I, I get where you're going with this. I've heard this five times today. <laughs> yo, he got him on a lot. <laughs> he was a pimp in his day. Yo, all back. his all hey, yo, he, wait, wait, he that passes, win, bro. He was a dangerous. All, <laughs> <laughs> I'm say, all the day. field tests. <laughs> yo, all the field tests. He got through them. Hey, yo, my nigga had the blood swinging field. back in the day. <laughs> right, right. He got through all the field tests. You always know what to say. Right. <laughs> You just said all the right stuff. All oh the right God. stuff. All the time. All the you time. make me feel so special. <laughs> no, oh, but, but for me, I don't, I particularly don't, I just think pickup lines are cheesy. Mm. So for me, what gets me is if, like, just, not even gets me, but like, if you just have a, just a regular conversation, I'm cool with that. I got you. Don't hit me with pickup lines, so that's ass. But see, I know niggas who will say a pickup line like, in a funny way, but it's still kind of like uh, yeah, yeah. Still smooth, cheesy. and it's funny and shit, and and females be going for it. We're like, that's your game, huh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you see how you try to uh, let your steam uh, dropping his jewels, <laughs> right? <laughs> dropping his jewels. No, I just, I mean, I I just feel like you, when you meet so many people. Throughout the day, or in whatever you do, if you're if you if you're in a field where you meet people on a consistent on a constant basis, you you kind of appreciate just like a regular conversation without mm-hmm. the extra shit. Like it's cool just to be like, oh okay, that was a cool person, and they get the fuck out, and you drive on about your day. No, it don't. No, it does not. It does not just work for ugly people. <laughs> <laughs> ugly people, right? No, you know it. Why you gonna always get that because you rocking. So it's like no matter what. No, nah, like, they gonna say some shit to you to see where you. No, are. no, no. What I'm saying is, as far as like, if you're looking to in intrigue me, I'm not gonna speak to everybody. But if you're looking to intrigue me, like a regular conversation is fine, and then you can go on about your day. The way you saying is like we can have a regular conversation. Then before I get out, I'd be like, yo, let me get your number or whatever. Oh yeah, then I mean that's but that's not a. Pick up now. That's more so like no, the conversation was saying, decent. If, like, then you could be like, yeah, then I just be like, oh no, nah, you know, I'm so seeing somebody. I, that's not what he wants, right? He doesn't uh, want you to say no. No, no, because no, I've got people in the beginning of the in the beginning of the ride. They'll hit you with the, oh, you seen somebody? Yeah, all right, cool. And Bro, then so the conversation will happen. Yeah. And then just before they got the car, like, hey, hey your you ride's know. probably be treacherous, bro. You probably. I like, can imagine. Yeah, no, that should be treacherous. Cool. Yeah. A lot of stuff no, going on. No, just be cool. Bro. Like I'm. No, I met like really cool people that have done really that. Like the dude really with the DVDs. Cheap. Nah. <laughs> but, <laughs> no, and then like. And the carpenter. <laughs> you stupid. I right, said that. That was not even in a ride. Oh, say that. You don't oh. listen. But anyway, 
Like, you know, I tell them in the beginning, and then at the end of the ride, they still hit you with the, oh, you know, so, like, if your nigga fuck up, you know, I would love to take you out of dinner. I'm like, nah, like, I'm good. Because I'm not going to ever talk to you again. Mm. And then that's it. You might be blocking your blessings, <laughs> as the old folks say. No, you might be I'm, blocking your blessings. You never no, I'm know. Just, like, I'm good where I'm at. And if I am, then it'll come back around. You, you hit them with the, I'm good, good love, and joy. Say. Yeah, I do. I hit them with that. Like hey, have y'all? Mm-hmm. What side? What side? South side. Riverdale. South side in the house. Oh, Riverdale. Boy, you you, mm-hmm. you, you sounded well, like. I don't know. I don't know where you're from. Yo, cut. So that's why I said that. I've but no, never I'm heard a uh, uh, out of town to say that <laughs> shit, bro. <laughs> I no, but, but I feel you. No, no, bit, I, I only say it. say it because it's so many people that aren't. I'm trying to say it. I'm trying to say it. No, I understand. It's so many people that aren't from here that even when I say yeah, this yeah, stuff, yeah. like they kind of just be like, oh, Atlanta. I'm like, okay, but well, see, whatever. Type of women. I, I got caught up with that before. A young lady told me she's from Atlanta and she's from Jonesboro. Like, Atlanta no. girls are stripping on the poles. Yeah, Remember no. Y'all reading poetry. It's a whole different woman. So you tell the uh, I'm not gonna say that. I know some girls from Riverdale is definitely true. But no, no, no. I get no. Yeah, so no. Let's. I stand corrected. I'm from Riverdale. I am not from Atlanta. Yeah. For the out of towners, but I am from Riverdale. Let's let's be clear. But no, I meet so many people that's from out of town that when I say Riverdale, they be like, "Oh, is that in Atlanta?" And they just be like, "Yeah, because yeah." He definitely had him on the track in Philly, bro. I see what's going on right here. No, I'm telling you, definitely. bro. My nigga at the door. Mm-mm-mm. Somebody, somebody yeah, out here sweet. mad right now. Somebody mad. Somebody heard you. Some girl, some girl mad. She's still saying you ain't shit from like five years ago. Are you sure? I'm positive. Nah. Listen, you ain't got no game if you got one. Yeah, I don't have none of them. Like all my exes. You be ending on the bad notes and shit, right? So he said he said something right then. What? So if you wait. Let's, let me get this clear. No, no, so, you no, know, no. He, he's saying so. No, I agree with him. I don't think people heard. Nobody heard him, so say it again. I said, I said, you ain't got no game if you still got women out here mad at you. Oh. 100%. 100%. Life goes on. Oh, 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 but it, when they look at the overall picture, they like, man, he a good guy. Like he's a good guy. I can't really be. I can't be mad. Or like he really is a good guy. There's a caption I just put up or a quote I just put up. Say, I don't think black women are bitter. They're just disappointed. Say that again. I don't, I don't think, think black, black women, women are bitter. bitter. They're just disappointed. That's where that poetry shit come from. See, that's that Riverdale right there. That's, that's, my that's that Riverdale. That <laughs> that's good. I see that. Yeah, it's some. It's some of them disappointed. <laughs> They, it's so much about this point. Like, yeah. it's, it's like, well, I got some, I got some ones that disappointed. I ain't I even bitter. I'm like, what's up? And yeah, then they have to get over all that shit. Yeah, yeah see, now that's the that bullshit. Like, like, don't call me. See that? Oh, see that? I don't like. He light skin. He light skin. You gotta put that in there. No, I ain't gonna lie. Light skin niggas got a whole different agenda. Y'all got, y'all got a whole black panther. Black panther. Who's all what? We was on Wakanda forever we were, we 20 were, minutes ago. We, were, we was on here 20 minutes ago. Now they just switched it up. Went to some American shit. Hey, what's up? Hey, bro. Yeah. No, see, I, I, I don't that. I don't like that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm just like, I don't like that. Like, I'm just done. Like, I'm 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 done. No, and that, and then, but that's my thing. And we 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 had that moment where it was like, and I was just like, yeah, like this still serves. It, I feel like that nigga was number two. My mom would still be there. Uh, like, nah, 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 nah. We we did that. You still fuck with? Uh, just on some cool shit. Not even. Excellent. I mean, yeah, but like he got a baby and like a wife. But you and still was solid and say what's up and see how he doing. It. I mean, you know, every once in a while. Yeah, but we was in so like high that. school. Yeah, I mean, that's different. But I'm saying cool. like, why was you cool? Why Cause why are you calling him? I don't is get that. Why is he calling me? Like, no, see, there you go. No, he he asked you. He asked <laughs> yo, you. He, yeah, just, yeah. he just throwing him out there. No, yeah, I'm like, yo, where are you going with this? <laughs> no, no, because when he said you still fuck with exes, you said uh, yeah, I don't. I, no, as in he said, you know, just conversation. So he was like, when you call them, to me, it's like if they exes, why are you calling them anyway? 
There should be no calling them. We should be calling you. I mean, to be honest, I was there when, like, he invited me to, like, his whole house soiree when he announced that the girl was pregnant. So, yeah, yeah. No, that's not crazy. This is like my. This is. I mean, cause you after cool? st- yeah, like bro, you gotta. What cool is when I see you somewhere? We cool. Oh, we but you gotta understand how old I was. I was not. I was. I was. I dated this guy since I was like fifteen, until I was like nineteen, twenty. Friends, bro. Like we was friends before that. So. Yeah, as we get older, you realize, like, yeah, I was in love and it was hurting. You cry and get over that shit. And it's like, yeah, we older. Like, Y'all we were young. Like. We was young, whatever the fuck. They were in like 15. I'm just saying, like, real talk, bro. Ain't no, no love not, that no 15, I'm not 17. saying that yeah, it's feel. not possible. But, I mean, when, when you Y'all when you like. with somebody from, like. from that age until whenever, it's like, that grows into something. So, yeah, it didn't work out. And we didn't talk for two years in between that. But, like, we over that shit. And, like, yeah, I was, yeah, I was there when... He Here's the real his question. Child was there and everything. Does his old lady know who you are? Yeah. But you know, I'm gonna tell you as a man, right? When he's calling you to come, shit, check his shit out. And watch, shit watch, watch and see the man. Right. He's, no, he's definitely, he he's definitely checking the temperature come, now. Like, mm, no, because it definitely don't even be on that type, type okay. of type of ordeal. I mean, it's been he's, years he's since I've seen him, mind. but no, it don't even be on. I'll that say, type I'll say this. If his if his old lady know exactly who you are, mm-hmm. then it's it's fair game at that point. I'm just saying, like if she know exactly, like if she know, like oh this, like they dated when they were 15, 16, 17. I years mean, old. to be honest, like the girl that he's with ended up being you went kind of you went be in my career. His, just... <laughs> his sister's like one of her friends, like years later, so um, she knows who I am. Uh, it it oh, sounds no. like an R and B song. <laughs> it sounds like something <laughs> happening for real. It definitely nah. some good writing material. Absolutely not. But so, I mean, one more time, big shout out to Last Name Good for the gumbo. Oh, for sure. Yeah, now nah, that shit, that, I would have paid for that, bro. That's love. Man. Hey, I appreciate that right there. You still ain't telling the price, but we're gonna talk about that off air. Hmm? Yeah, we're gonna talk I about think that off air. Corner, bro. Hey, I, hey, but you know, behind this shout out, he was practicing. though. this was a practice round. Holy because if y'all listen to the last episode, we were talking about for the one year. Yeah, we was. So, we was. We was. Yeah. Now we was. We so was. check this out. So I got to see what's going no, on. No, and you know what's wild? My, my I'm about to check the temperature. <laughs> <laughs> no, what's wild is while you was, while when you sent that picture, my mom, my mom made gumbo for her birthday. With that, with that, with that celery? Yeah. The mix. <laughs> and then I was hyped. He was like aromatic. So I was like, ooh. He out here with the big shot. Word. Can I can I can I give y'all the honest like what happened like oh, for yeah. real for real right? After the jokes, after the jokes. Yeah. No no the jokes no, no <laughs> hey no the jokes are perfect the jokes are perfect I'm, I'm I'm with the jokes I'm with it but like real talk like it was some shrimp that we thought like my, my old lady had some shrimp thought I was just like you know can you cook I was like cool I make some gumbo and really what it was because we talked about it last week it was fresh in my mouth like right, cool I make some gumbo. I wouldn't even think about bringing it on in. I posted. Um, so he hit you with the got the when you got the ar- aromatics going. That was that was just on some like throw a shot at y'all since no, y'all talking about bro, I can't, you can't cook. Post about the aromatics. I posted and the picture. That about. was that was legit on some like oh they talking about I can't cook. Let me show y'all this real quick. When I posted the picture of the uh, gumbo, y'all the one put the battery in the back. They talking about um. Like no, nah, I was this, this was your man put the battery. In the, he really the one who did it. He it, tells it back sound, that sound good. good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, all right, like, cool. True. Y'all bogus. That's what made me bro. When you said right. that sound guy, like all right, but cool, no, my bro. mom made gumbo for her birthday last weekend, and I had because she's allergic to seafood. I had to peel the fucking um, shrimp and shit. Mm. So it was funny because as I was doing that, I was like, I was thinking about it, like, yeah, I definitely gotta get in my gumbo bag in the next three weeks. I should probably be prepared for that. And then when you sent the aromatics, <laughs> I was like, ah, let me go buy the stuff and get me a little, <laughs> give me a little test bowl going real quick. Yeah. <laughs> well, my nigga, your shit was scrumptious, bro. Appreciate that, man. For real. Yeah, it was definitely scrumptious, bro. Appreciate it. For real, for real. My first time gumbo. Oh, word. Okay, yeah. well. Oh, word. You never. The seafood shit. We talked about this. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'll make. I'll. I'll, I'll <laughs> man, <nasty. laughs> Wait, I was. So just, you're you? not allergic to anything, are you? Uh, ants. <laughs> this nigga, bro. <laughs> That's Why real. Guess, and bees. For I am allergic to bees. Oh, I'm dying. I'm out of here. I'm, I, I was gonna say, oh no, I'm, I'm dying. Out of here. Bees. Oh um, nah, it was on national security. National security. I'm out of here. Bees, I'm da- I'm out. Mm. Send me up to the Peru. And uh, uh, I'll be out here looking like bro, a hitch. Yeah, <laughs> with the Benadryl. That's one of my favorite movies, though. Real talk. Oh, yeah. For real? Got to have to keep uh, you some bit well, of a little bit. I'll do. Well, if are we doing this cookout for real? Oh uh, yeah. So since, oh. since you brought the gumbo, yeah, you, you don't. Somebody else up next. Oh, Who so up? You, yeah, you declared yourself, huh? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> bro, how you get the practice run and the test? <laughs> but you had the answers. <laughs> All those. You had that, the answers, Sway. <laughs> look, if if I brought some food and everybody agreed that the food was good, <laughs> why do I need to prove myself that oh, I can so cook you, again? So you done married? You were celebrating the one year. Okay, well, Yo, well I ain't like, making gumbo okay, again. That's, hey, that's no, it. How he, how he yeah, we can make something else. In the merit. What they trying to say is that could have been a lucky pop. Oh. Here it goes. Here, here go the wit. <laughs> here go the wit. I'll put wit. it like this. Gumbo ain't no meal. You just go in like say, I'm going to make tomorrow. No, that like, ass, that, you got to have the funds prepared. Yeah, oh, bro. Like that ain't no. Aside. That ain't no like. And that, that and to be fair, that's no, a light. That wasn't no light. That, that wasn't. That wasn't the gumbo for real. Yeah, no, no, no. no. <laughs> I was gonna say. Steve, that was Steve gonna say. know what I'm saying. <laughs> what I'm saying, I'm talking about seafood wise. Like I could have legit went and bought like. I know what he's talking about. I could have went and bought like blue shell crabs, bro. And, like really yeah, I was went gonna like. Say, that's what I, you know. No, fam, like that's know. light. Like the crab, that's the crawfish. Like the meat that's in it. Meat, shrimp. Um, I put I did turkey sauce because I don't mess with pork like that. And um, crab. And then it was like corn and all that shit. Like, no, 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 no corn, corn, in. corn. No corn. That's that's. I don't care, bro. I'm not. I'm not from New Orleans, so it's what like it wasn't the okra in there, was it? No, no. No, no. I mean, they got they got different types of gumbo, but yeah. If you. Yeah, nah, they got different no, types. No, it's um, it's uh, I mean, you got you got your aromatics. Hit it. You what, know, what, let, get into the aromatics. The aromatics. For those that don't know. So all right, like for real, for real, you gotta you gotta make a room. I'm gonna hit Steve for the word. Like the ho- it's the holy. And you gotta you gotta you gotta make the room right. So like the room to start with the room. What I started with was um. I just cook the sausage and you what you do so you cook the sausage and then you use the grease to start to make your roux. So with that you need flour and um, water, you know what I'm saying, and, and a little bit of oil to make your roux from that. Then you add your aromatics. That's the celery, the onion, um, garlic, and um, uh, green pepper. Like I, bl- I like blended it to make it real fine. You know what I'm saying. Then you put that in there. And, you gotta let that go for that's probably like forty minutes right there doing that. Cook cook that down. And then you add tomatoes. I, I use canned tomatoes. Tomatoes and I can't tell you the seasoning that that's in there. Like that's that's something else. But I will be honest and come clean and tell you that like the main thing that's used came straight from New Orleans. And that's garlic powder, straight from like a spot in New Orleans. It's you garlic powder. You got New Orleans in your blood? No, nah, not at all. But we go to New Orleans probably about like two, three times a year. So, so who? You, I'm just curious. Did you? I don't, bro. I don't. <laughs> no, I'm just curious. Well, Steve been quiet on the on the on the cooking. If y'all, hold on, since you try to come in, got there, throw your little shots in. <laughs> if you listen to our last uh, uh, podcast, last I said episode. I'll be financing some shit if they got their need be. Listen, you don't need a bitch ass thing. I told you. <laughs> I told. I didn't. No, no, he that no, never no, came no, out he, my mouth. No, he didn't. What? Pause. We will pause that one right there. I ain't gonna let oh, you go. Shit. I ain't gonna let you do that to yourself. What? See, he ain't even catch you right now. I caught you, God. I'm now with you, God. Yeah, yeah. What I said? Peace, peace. <laughs> huh? Come out your mouth. Oh <laughs> shit! Come on. Yeah. <laughs> 
on. I, I just, I just Come feel on, like. Cause, bro, that nigga ain't on that gay <laughs> shit, bro. Like niggas don't even be thinking about that type of shit, bro. Like yo. ain't nobody catching every goddamn like that's y'all land, bro. Y'all that's got that, that New York. Yeah. Well, wait. So I'm curious. I'm just curious. Where Where did you get your recipe from? Hey, some freaks. Where did I get the what? Your recipe from? They were like they. Ass. Um, like real talk. I don't. I don't. You can You could talk to my wife. Like if I try to make something using the recipe, it's mm-hmm. trash. Okay. Because I'm I'm horrible at following directions trying to cook. I'm not good at that. It got to come from the soul. Well, yeah. I'm, he's more visual. No, well, I'm just no, saying. No, I'm saying, like, I can't you, tell you no, how much. No, nigga, love. that's you. Yeah, I couldn't tell you how much <laughs> you season are more I put in love. love. Like, I, no, no, you just. H is more visual. Yeah. No, I'm just asking because you said you, well, you know, you. No, no, no what I did when I was Hold in. Hold on, pause. H tried to get some company. He did. <laughs> yeah. When nigga, I, uh, it's just you. He, he you really the only did. one on that bus. When I went to New Orleans, one of the last time I went to New Orleans, like, I was um trying to bring something back. And so I asked, I asked. I asked a lady who worked in the grocery store. I was like, man, what y'all be putting in y'all gumbo? And she was like, she gave me the very generic stuff. And she was like, but really? You need some of this garlic powder. Mm-hmm. She was like, if you don't put this in here, you know, but she could have been lying as far as I know. But I mean, she looked like she cooked gumbo at the house. Like, yeah. Like, she had a gold tooth? She did have a gold oh, tooth. Oh, yeah, she definitely, yeah. She like, oh, baby, like, she, he, baby, you need to, um. Hey, that, they got their gold, too. They the ones. Yeah, that's, that's one the Lord they told the, <laughs> No, that ass. They, they came from heaven. They self. <laughs> the <laughs> cool yeah. ones, Open face and yeah. all. Oh, they got yeah, open face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody in that house calling them T.D. Yeah, they got T.D. Yeah, T.D. Yeah, yeah. Uh, T-D. It's T.D. Uh-huh. It's T.D. over there. Yeah. Hey, no, real talk, though. I love New Orleans, man. Like, uh, New Orleans is it's real good. Shit, but it definitely, bourbon, bourbon stink. But. You know, um, I mean, yeah, we we usually get a, we get a chance to like really be around, but like not like in the hood, hood. But we we still get a chance to be around. Yeah, you gotta. But we we don't been in the hood and didn't know we was in the hood. Steve knew. We told no. that story before oh, on the you podcast. You've been to New York City? No. You've been to New York City? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just think of her. I mean, Come on, God. Come on, God. No, I'm just saying because when you say New Orleans is the best city. I said that's my well, favorite city. No, whoa, whoa. no, no, no. no. I'm not gonna lie. Been I've been to New York. New York is cool, but if you're gonna go like culture wise, what the fuck? We don't got no culture. Y'all are right. <laughs> you feel like, <laughs> but <laughs> New, New Orleans got that shit. Y'all hey. could never compare so to that say, shit. I mean, you gotta go with a local. Thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I agree I, with. I it. mean, no. Now, well, I need I'm, you to show me around the Bronx. I like, mean, as far as culture really. wise, I'm not saying that y'all city is Bronx, great. This rap shit would yeah, be we we on. know that, but I'm just saying <laughs> culture wise, like y'all, the well, New Orleans, that. the way that city is and yeah, it's set yeah. up, it's it's different. Like man. you can't not go there and not have a good time, and you cannot not you can't talk shit about that city. Like yeah, I, I never but been better. So if you go, if you for real, you never been. Fast yeah. and light, bro. That's it a, that's it a is good not a, ride, it's bro. not far, bro. Hey, look, you that's can blow whole, it up. Yeah. That's a whole, yeah. That's what you want to do, bro. We ride it, bro. I love the accent, too. That's like, yeah. No, you have to go. That baby. You got to go. That shit will fuck you I, I up. I like women, New Orleans, for women, I don't want to hear that shit, because that's like a hypnotized shit. When they like, baby, and it's like... Yeah. And the streets. Like, whatever you say. <laughs> <laughs> It, it like, is, even if it ain't no shit going on, you should go to the casino, no, get the club one time, yeah. get the gambling, something going on, bro. You gotta go. You know, right? Yeah. 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 I'm taking him to do my end, fifth ward and ninth ward. All Low that, ninth, yeah, and all that. That's what my dad's from. Yeah, good time. Oh, where, where BG from? BG. Uptown, eh? Ain't you from Uptown? Oh, Uptown, yeah. No, you gotta go. It's it's. Yeah, I don't know, Ace. You can't. It's a. What's What's Oh no, fail you! <laughs> you don't look calico. like you can. No, actually, no. Age, age actually can be. Nah, he can be for the door. I said calico, calio. He can be for the door. Yeah, he can be for the door. You need some slugs in your mouth, though. Yeah, you need some slugs in your mouth. You have some slugs. You might can be from New Orleans. Yeah. Now, real look, talk. If you are gonna quote me, quote me, bro. I said that's my favorite city. Not it's the best city. Oh, okay. All right. The best city is LA. Nah, yeah, wow. Depending so on who you talking to. Depending on who you talking. Hey, L.A. beautiful, man. Is it competition? L.A. L.A. gets you caught up, boy. Oh, shit. shit. I like Philly. Y'all got to y'all got to deal with that off camera because this got personal. Yeah, yeah, it got personal. It got personal. I like Philly. Huh? huh? New York better than Philly. I like 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 Philly. I like
like Philly. Izzy I mean, I don't, I don't know what to say what's better, but I, I like Philly. Yeah. Izzy say New York better than Philly. It is. Bro, ain't none of that shit better than Atlanta, so I don't give a fuck what y'all talking about. Facts. Facts. Yeah, y'all talking about. Nah, watch out, bro. All right, all right. Let's go. I told y'all. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go Hey, um, so, like, check this out, though. Before before we do that, I did put. Hold what on, you bro, said? Hold on. I'm sorry. No, I told you that's personal. Y'all going to do that on camera. That's Let's personal. Because you're going you gonna to speak with passion. I am, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's cut. I already see it. Hey, um, so I, uh, we posted a question on our uh, IG trying to do like it's like culturally ratchet question, right? So yes. I asked somebody to ask a Who culturally ratchet question. Who got motherfucking culture ratchet question? So this one comes from, of course, who I'm gonna say our number one supporter is Marty. Um, he really Facts. be he like be on every episode. Yeah, he legit be hey, on every Marty. episode. Where is he from? He from here. here. He from yeah. Atlanta. Shit. We yeah. Gotta invite him to be like one, the one year anniversary. There you go. For sure. Taste that gumbo. So uh, Marty asked his uh, <laughs> his culturally <laughs> ratchet question is. Shut up, H. <laughs> have any of y'all been to Bankhead Seafood? And if so, do you miss it? Yes. I don't think I've been to Bankhead. Seafood. Yeah, I've been, I've been but like it's been. There no more. That's nah. just closed. I think they closed. Like, I think Killer Mike and them trying to open it back yeah, up. Yeah, they're trying to. Yeah, yeah. Killer Mike and T.I. bought it, and I, I don't know what they're going to do with it, but it closed like at the top of last year, I Bro, feel like. But it's on some like. Uh, better than JJ's? Shit, no. So it's on some. Uh, <laughs> That's a problem. That's a problem. No, it's, it's still good. It's good. Yeah, yeah. But. See, now you trolling, bro. Everything was credible up until... Bro, it's like, Everything it's like you one time. It's your one time, bro. Yeah, I eat at both spots, bro. JJ's is better than goddamn... Oh, whatever, bro. <laughs> yeah, JJ's, the whiting is salty. It's not even... Because it ain't real. You know, it's white. Oh, oh. Let me put this Let me put this out there. I only had the fish one time in my life, and I eat that, like, every week. So, I, t- I take that back. I had some trout or some shit from there, like... Yeah. But I take that, so I take that back. I, I fuck with the chicken wings, bro. Yeah, the wings. Like, ain't nobody checking. Yeah, the wings. All right, so uh, powerful. Man, what the fuck I was just about? Oh, the uh, the bankhead shit. Yeah, it's on. It's on this H. You got to eat it hot. Like you try to reheat that motherfucker. Trash. Trash yeah. bag. Well, I'm talking about waste management. Out the grease. On some goddamn little Caesars type shit, like. A lot, <laughs> fresh like, out the grease. But fresh out that grease and them hush puppies and shit, bro. Ooh. Bro, that, that was it, Bankhead. Yeah. And it's cheap. It's like, been a while, bro. I was talking about, I ain't been to Bankhead Seafood like a long time. Yeah, yeah. Metropolitan. Metropolitan, yeah. 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 Metropolitan, yeah. Metropolitan, yeah. I just go to Bankhead Seafood. It's, on, South, South, it's, on, it's off of Bankhead. But I mean, it's at, the it's at West Lake. It's at no, West I'm Lake. Sure. Listen to me, bro. I'm trying to explain it to you, bro. I'm, not, I'm making it simple for you. North side, east side, west side. It's on the west side. side. Bankhead is on the west side. That's all I oh, okay. He, I thought you knew that though. I don't know. I yeah. didn't know if you was. He didn't put doing a bankhead. Or no. You, have you he, ever heard of bankhead? <clears throat> oh, that, no, exactly. But exactly. It's called bankhead seafood. It's called bankhead. You right. You right. Yeah, I was gonna say he. He right. He don't, he, he don't know. He don't, come on, we got it. It's bless fair. His, bless, bless, uh, his bro, bless his little heart. Bless his little heart. That one said this man is, is you. A, you I'm that's a problem. We live hip hop daily. You ain't you ain't stumping the streets. But you we got daily, right? Yeah. You stomping the streets? Yeah. I'm stomping the streets with you. <laughs> he got a point. To it. <laughs> your feet, bro. Your feet is his feet. Your feet is my feet, bro. He do. He I do. I go from here and to? then I go that yeah. way. And if, if there's an event, I'm bro, we're going. We 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 in the hood tomorrow. Me and you, we in the hood tomorrow. Oh, y'all on the no. streets? No, we in the hood. No, hood, no, bro. You can't ain't. be here and not know what the fuck going on. This gentrified hood. This is not the hood. No. 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 Not no more. <laughs> <laughs> the hood. <laughs> are the you, hood. Are you scared right now? Right. Niggas are you is walking their right dogs. Wait, 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 bust it. Are you scared right Niggas now? Niggas is towing their cars to you, park. Oh, hold on. Bro. Here's the perfect part right here. No. Hey, you got that thing outside right now. If we was in the hood, you would be cussing at that door right now. That it with that thing Most outside. The facts, bro. You, well, your neighbors call the cops when they park somewhere else. Exactly. Wait, wait. I ain't gonna say that. Well, I ain't gonna say that. Yeah. Yo, when we first came here, huh? the white people wasn't here, so when we Part of me. It, yeah, <laughs> but what I'm saying is, you haven't seen the changes there, to where you know you're not in the hood right there, now? I, I, made, I made the statement that there is no cops in the hood in Atlanta. The real hoods in Atlanta, when I drive down Camelton from Lee Street to Stanton Road, there is no cops in Atlanta. I can't say that. Cause they, no, I can't, I can't say home, that. I drive home every night. I'm telling Brad. y'all, from, that, from, from Lee Street. So what's name? There is no. It be the streets be empty. You know what I'm saying? Bruh, I just see. I hear stuff, and when you go, when I'm on Bankhead and I'm driving from uh, 
that Vine City, Martin Luther King, when I'm back there and I'm around and I cut down those blocks by accident, and, and you all in those, in those dead ends, there is no cops around there. All I'm going to say is, I was just, oh, I was going to say, I was just over yeah. there. When was this? Us? Uh, now, now, if there's a, now, they're in the high you know, areas like the gas stations and all of that, but I'm talking about where it goes. They're going to be you know, on the main streets, and they gonna, but I'm talking about in the hood. Oh, no, where, I'm talking about they had where like, down, where they, they had where they two. supposed to be really sitting on the corners that they not in there. No, I'm I, saying. When you back, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, when, you, when you back Bond City and you in that little where the uh, where they all of them was abandoned houses, when you driving through there, you don't see cops in, in, in those, uh, in those what's names you don't. That's why it's the highest rate for heroin. No, I was gonna say uh, I was I was just over there on Saturday and Sunday, I adamantly disagree. and both times I seen two APD SUVs yeah, over there, and they discussion. had a Lexus wide the fuck open. Hey. And they had the they had the Lexus wide the fuck open, in the hood tomorrow. taking out shit out of the driver's seat. So I ain't gonna say they don't be over there. Yeah, but they be over there. I stayed off Metropolitan for like I'm 10 telling plus years. I'm by, by one o'clock, bro. <laughs> Uh, no, I'm not talking huh? about Main Street. I'm talking about in the cut. Right not, not on that. I'm, I'm talking not talking about, about on Metro. I'm talking about this is in the cut. Like, yeah. I wasn't even supposed to be over there. This is in the cut. Yeah, not, no, no. Like, no, no. I pulled over to, like, adjust my shit. And I was like. So, I'm, I'm also I... <laughs> kind of offended, too, right? I'm, 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 about to, I'm about to tell you, bro. I'm about to tell you, bro. You come to my city, you don't even want to experience the whole thing. What do you mean experience? You see like, you don't want to see what we got going on. I've been to the blood. If I go to New York, I want to see what y'all got going on. <laughs> I want to see what y'all got going on. All right, but see, I know I'm gonna take. I can take. What you mean? All right. Oh yeah. What's your bro? What's your bro? Where, bro? I've been to the bluff though. I went down. That's cute, bro. I went that way. I went down. I'm good, bro. I went to the bluff. I'm good, bro. I'm good, bro. And I figured to me, this right here is the hood. This is not the hood. It's not. It's not like not the hood. I tell you, I will put it like this, H. You want to know why it's not the hood? H, H, H. H, H. You want to know why? You want to know why this is? You don't even know what downtown. No, Let's move on. No, no, no. You want to know what? No, no. You thinking about Midtown? He think Hard Rock Cafe is Atlanta downtown. Downtown is. I heard people call this midtown where we at. What? No. Oh no, I'm not gonna lie. Is implant like you? Yeah, I was gonna say they wear yeah, implants. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Imp- oh, no, oh, implants oh, do oh, call oh, this part oh, midtown. I'm so like, I think, I think this is more downtown than midtown. Yeah, but that's what I be trying to tell people. This is not. Yeah, that's yeah, the underground. That's, once you come out the underground right. and go where all them all shops the way, at, exactly. that's the real But downtown. I have heard transplants once say this is midtown. I'm like, this is not fucking midtown. Stop saying that shit. Atlantic Station and 10th Street. Yeah, I was on 10th Street and, and up. Real Tend talk. Piedmont, really. No, real talk. North Avenue. Yeah, well, Fox. You think Pass North well, I mean Avenue. Tenth, I mean 10th, like that Pass way, Ju- uh, by Juniper. North and, uh, Avenue. That's what I'm saying. When like, that part. North Avenue, when you, when you make that little turn. And right. 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 Midtown, right. Right, right. And once you cross right. on the that's bridge, I'm exactly. fucking with them. I'm yeah. fucking with them. Right, that's what I'm, I'm saying. I'm fucking with them. That's it. That's it. I'm with you, bro. I'm yeah. fucking with them, bro. You, I don't know about you. You, I don't know about you, bro. <laughs> you different. <laughs> you different. <laughs> you ain't, look. He's he supposed to be here. I don't know. I'm fucking with them. They know I'm they know they they you right now. Like, How did like, you get here? <laughs> yeah, they appreciate they stay here. Ain't y'all here like bitch? I call they gonna carry on. They gonna they gonna carry on. They Philly. They carried on. They Philly pride or whatnot. But they. Yeah, you know they know where they at. They know, know where they at. They know what time it is. You the only nigga that don't know what time problem, it is. Bro. But you want, to, but you want to know what it is though, like for real. That don't fucking count right now, nigga. You still sorry. <laughs> that was it. You you, you you drove through the bluff. Right. You drove through the bluff. He probably ain't drive. He probably had an Uber. It was like, oh yeah, we ride through here. We gonna ride through you, here. You ain't never went down English Avenue. No, you had an he Uber. No, nigga, you had an Uber. Hey, he was on Sunset. And then you quickly got the fuck out of there. Yeah, you, you realize you were. Right. Yeah. Now, 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 you see how that felt when you turned in there? Oh, 
Now compare that to here and ask the this the hood. You, the way you felt when you made that turn. Don't nobody feel like that. You, don't nobody feel like that when they were over here. <laughs> That's the difference. I, 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 my cousin came over here to visit from Philly. And he like, uh, I want to go to the hood. I'm like, no, you don't, cuz. <laughs> right, Rightfully on, we so. Going, you know what I'm saying? So I immediately took him down to the bluff around there. He was like, all right, we can go. That, that's that's no, that's Atlanta the tip. hoods like you gonna see apartments that's burnt halfway. Oh, well, all they got burnt all, the all on the windows. In them. You mm-hmm. going, like you got five or six houses. Right. Like the right. right. Like, like a and I'm gonna tell you a real quick look. Funny shit. Remember my man? I said from college he used to sit here. He been here the last two weeks. That dude who was sitting here. I had to drive him. Yeah. Home. Yeah. Right, I had to drive him home. <coughs> driving him home, and right, we getting into these shits, and I'm like, yo, we went past a project. The fucking lights is, we could cut all the lights off, and there was a, there was like five niggas just standing there talking to each other, and one like nigga, ain't shit going on. Say, one nigga standing like this. Yeah. That yeah. Shit is crazy. And I don't even know where I'm at. I was about to ask you where were y'all live? He don't know. This way. He probably he probably thought he was in a bluff still. Like, yo. That's the west side you're going <laughs> that way. Yes. <laughs> like, yo, what the fuck? It's like and that's crazy, right? I always think about that. I grew up in the projects, but then when I went to college in Virginia and all these other places and I go to a project everywhere was, but New Orleans. I didn't live in no fucking projects. <laughs> hey, tell her, tell her what you told, what you asked me when, when you take me home that first hey, time. I'm taking Steve home. This is probably like two in the morning. Hold on, hold on. Word, this, it. hold on. This is this one of them nights I was kicking his ass on that two K. But go ahead, bro. <laughs> that's why we left so late. Go ahead, bro. The last few times. You only as good as your, you only as good as your last victory. All right, yes, all right, all right, um. Only good as your last victory. <laughs> he sound like a coach for real. Facts. <laughs> I'm taking Steve home like two in the morning. Right. We ride down the street. I'm talking about it's like a summer day. Y'all going to in the summer afternoon. Everybody outside kicking it, gambling, stores, drinking. Running <laughs> across the street, like every block we go to, it's a bunch of people. That's the hood. Like, Rats playing dice. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Walking to the car, like what's up, you need something? Like nah, like yeah, yeah. that's crazy. He said, "Where you got me going?" And that's bro. two two a.m. Right? <laughs> two a.m. Two a.m. He said two a.m. Looking like it was two p.m. Yeah. Right that fit, bro. For the people that want to know, he was going down Simpson Road, I'm almost certain, right? Yeah. 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 In New York City, that's how I felt when I went to a part uh, called Queensbridge. Three in the morning. It's Why he talking like, well, <laughs> bro, you just, no, bro, he like how you I just, thought he was about to say so. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like how you just talk to us like that. Like Queensbridge. Like, yeah, nigga, we know Queensbridge. Uh, I always got to say New York City because if it wasn't for the Bronx, this rap shit wouldn't be going I'm ready to Yeah, but you said Queensbridge. <laughs> it's like, time. We didn't, it's time. It's yeah. about that time. Yeah, yeah, we, yeah. We'll go ahead. Hey, bro, where Ron Browse at, man? Mm. Mm. I know. We ain't heard since. He just Wait. came out. He said, I know. We ain't heard since. Maybe two months ago. I mean, you know, mm. came out with a new what? New new song. He new raps song? and do same type shit. Same. He doing. He on the same vibe. Right. Same vibe. But you gotta hey. follow him to see that. So. Hey, what? I mean, I'm sorry. I'm gonna take over your. Brain. No, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. What? Red Cafe. Oh shit, word. where is he at? I just no, he just I was about to say he like he ain't well, even he really on the he, he got a job. <laughs> right. He was getting money from writing, so he probably said, Fuck it, I'm not gonna Hey man, it's a tough game, bro. I'm gonna get to where I wanna go because he don't wanna play that game and mm. he said, I'm a I could feel that though. Nigga. Yeah. If I had to try, I'd be a writer, but you know what I mean, like you just, you could walk around freely, bro. Right, like Drake can't go to the bathroom by himself, bro. Like said, you feel me? You just you get said, pissed on. You go to the hood, nigga. That's really technically. I live through you. I've been to the hood. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. <laughs> he tried, but this that, nigga that called everything the bluff. <laughs> yeah, that that wasn't it. You good, bro? Oh yeah. Okay, so my work of the week is sequester. Oh, okay, mm. go ahead. Hold on. Spell, spell yes, check. Mm-hmm. Okay. S E Q U E S T E R. Need to hear it. Sequester. Okay. <laughs> That's started, always no, funny, no, bro. When you started spelling it, I, I started spelling it's it. It's a so. definition to set apart, segregate. Definition number two to seize by authority of. I don't know what the writ is. Well, we sequester H to that bus on his own. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, that me though. All right. Um, my shout out of the week goes to Black Tex. Um, I just wanted to give a shout out to him because he always just takes really dope pictures and. Oh, my partner. Like, oh, okay. Yeah, I, don't, I don't feel like. I, see what I don't feel like he get a lot of credit. Like, shout out to Black Tex, man. Like, yeah, he got that's, a that's lot my of, dog. Bro, he be capturing moments that. I don't even be expecting, mm-hmm. but that's me personally. But then he just, he got a lot of good shit going on. And I just respect his work and his craft. And it's really cool to see somebody that that just does good shit and it gets recognized in numbers and not more so by, you know, him hyping his own self up. So, yeah, shout out to Black Text, man. That's my shout out to Black Text. Like, really? Y'all make sure y'all check him out. Hit him up. Y'all need some of them pics. For sure. He does all kinds of pics, weddings, and and, and all kinds of shoots. And, and he um, and all that good jazz. He shot the Paid in America album, No Free Lunch cover, and the inserts on Paid in America. Yeah, Those, those are definitely hard. So, yeah. Shout yeah. out to him, man. And what up, Black Tex? Yeah. Well, he he going to see his name on this on this, at, on this mention, but shout out to you, man. For Appreciate sure. You. Oh, um, <coughs> Get Funked Up Thursday. Y'all pull up, man. It's gonna this be a, Thursday. this Thursday. And when the hell we supposed to be going to get Florida? Get funked up. Get funked up. I thought that was this Thursday. It's next, next Thursday. Oh, next Thursday. Yeah. Okay. For sure. For sure. Y'all don't be telling me shit no more. It's all good. Group text. Bro. Group chat. It's all good, bro. We had a group chat. But if you know me, bro, you know how this shit go, bro. But I'm done with it, bro. Close us out, Shane. I was chilling in the six nah, he with really my phone. You need to upgrade, God. I get the group text, but you just don't understand what I'm talking about, bro. You need to mind your business, really. You on the other bus right now. You're not on the same bus. Pause. We all in a group text, right? I see, those. Right. I see those. No, Facts. I didn't say you see all in the group text. What? This brother came upstairs today, right? When he came up today, when he came, did what he did, and went to the to the refrigerator, my phone goes bleep. And it's like, oh shit! Is it his message was I'm downstairs? Down, I'm downstairs. He he's already here. You know what's the what's the? You, you said that was your phone. No, you know what's the common denominator? The common denominator is she got an iPhone, he got an iPhone. I got but if that iPhone. was the case, no, he he it, it, that is the truth he don't though. Got an iPhone. I don't oh. do that though. Like that's that's why they do. Like when it be when the group chat be green. And somebody like, but does that mean your message grid? comes late? It don't come. <laughs> He's off the grid. Right. Like I don't know why. Like like for real. Like I don't know why they do that. iPhone do that for real. But I been, but I been got it. Nah, I ain't got to upgrade. He just wants you to be a part of the iMessage family. Get down with the team, you can get that. You can get. But he's so pro black though. <laughs> nah, we got to get you a figure you, phone, bro. You so like, pro black though. Get you a figure phone. We don't know what he pro, bro. He switch up. Yeah, bro. He, he changed like draws, bro. Close the door. One minute. Like, he won't even make his own. You feel bro, what I'm like, bro? he won't even make his own award show. Bro, he changed like And stuff, he talking bro. about what, what we not for. Hey, let's wrap this up, though, for real. We, we like just like. Bro, you could just make your own shit up, though. Okay, it, it was eight fault, bro. Like, he went into that long ass story. Like, he, and he just, didn't even he watch. Bro, he was trying to set up for dramatic effect and shit. And he failed. But go ahead. We weren't even talking about that. We were talking about pre. He don't know. He on. This is where he's on. This is where he at. Let's just. He was over there. Leave him there. <laughs> <laughs> You're about to kill it. <laughs> he was over there sneaking over to try to see what was up. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the fact you said who me, <laughs> nigga, <laughs> yes, it's, you. It's the cor- I was going to ask good. I'm like, I don't want to take the last of it. It's the last <laughs> oh, no, no. Go ahead. Is that the corner? It's, it's the corner, corner of the Kool Aid. Like, nah, Blood, that nigga ain't saying. He hit you with the head. <laughs> I don't want to no, no, go ahead, go ahead. Wow. He was over there on the prime. <laughs> he was, I saw. I, uh, okay, he gave okay. me the side eye, like, shit. Yeah, yeah. Don't like it's fucking up, I will. But um, thank y'all for tuning in to this week's episode of the No Buffer Podcast. Y'all can catch us every Monday here at 7 p.m. at livehiphopdaily.tv. It's Last Name Good, the Lingo Steve and Cheyenne XO in the building. Um, Make sure y'all click the subscribe button, hit those likes, watch the videos, Apple Music. Uh, Spotify, all that good jazz, and you know we we out here buy some merch. God damn it, buy some culture ratchet, fucking merch, cause we are culture ratchet. We say what what we want, 
No buffer, just facts. And we'll see y'all asses next week. We out. Yeah.